Hello. Boom. Look at all of us back together again. You two had a nice week off. <laughs> well, you didn't have a nice week off, nor plague. Um, what was wrong with his week off? I think he had a lot of work to do. He had to work on some presentation or something. Hmm. And apparently, he stuffed it up the wall, so fat oh. a lot of good. No, I think he did. I think he did fine. Um, how are you back? Back from back from Sweden once again? Uh, yeah, sorry. Just give me one sec. Sure, mate. Nice yes, job, uh, I was Dr. Jonas Stratino Basso just resu bed um, for 66 months. Be We're back, back tonight's fain house. Nice jump, Alistair. Oh no. Matt Trattino Basso T just resu bed for 31 months. Oh, the fain houses last week were pretty, pretty average. <laughs> there was an AD game which he dodged. Oh, thank God. Uh, and. They I think I was. I, just, I think I was. I think I was just furious the entire time. Thank you. 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 Thank well, so they want they want to hear your your opinion on of what course, they're doing, of course. which is usually shitty this opinion. guy's fucking off. A fucking idiot! This bloke. Oh, I forgot I told you up to two hundred percent. Let me just fix that. Holy oh, shit! shit. <laughs> yeah, I've got I've got you nice up really job, loud as well. Alistair. Good God! Perfect. Nice, my name just is bed for twenty three months. Can you turn me up, Blake, just for the bounce? Why do you want me to be turned up? Nice job, I, I just Alistair. Want, want to be in your head. You're already you're, you're one twenty on the standard. For months. I'll put you up to one fifty. How about I don't that? Know if my Thank audio you. settings are right. No, they're not because I did play a couple of off-stream losses with uh, some of the lads. Luke trolled both games. He so, did. I think he, did he random in yeah, both. Yeah, just random both games. Like fucking idiot. I mean, if he was the best player in the stack, I was furious. It's just, I was absolutely furious. It's just. The thing is, like, he randomed Monkey, pause three, and did fucking nothing all game. It was very frustrating. He never apologizes. No, as much well, as he says he will. Well, no, no, no. Who's, who's, nice jump, Alistair. Who's got the brilliant Enrique bristle back name that I'm absolutely basso, fucking in love with? Oh, yeah, that's so funny. Right. I think it's Jake. I think it's Jake. Is that Jake? Yep. So Luke was <laughs> 5 and 15. I was Pressure 10 back is real 15. good. I'm, I'm a big fan of that. Ten kills in that game, and Luke Luke was the pause three. <laughs> Do yeah. not check, click on Jake's profile. My God, his previous matches. That is that is a rough. Wait, who's got the funny name? Bristle Bristle back Bristle in Buff. the lobby. Oh, very good. Who is this? That's Jake. Oh my God! And I just the, looked at the off games. Nice job, the elves Alistair. are looking. Oh, oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! But he's got he's renamed to to get in the power of a new name. Yeah. Mm. Let me just check in on this L. Uh he went nine, nine, and ten as undying. Hard support. He had more kills than anyone else on his team. How are you actually meant to say Bach? Bach. Is it like a is it a Bach or people people say Bach, which I've 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 never understood. I think that's only people whose bark is worse than their bite. Mm. Wow! Is it is, is, it, is it the impressive. same argument between uh, <laughs> Van Gogh and Van Gogh? I'm 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 in the Van Gogh camp. But it's not there are Van, definitely Gogh some Van Gogh either. It's like is it not? It's like Van Gogh or something like Van, that. Van Gogh. It's Dutch. Van Gogh. It's Van Gogh. Like everyone says, Heckler and Koch for the rifle, the the, the submachine guns. Heckler and Koch, they make guns, Diety. and it's not. It's like Koch. It's like we're gonna say Koch. I'm sorry. We're gonna say Koch. It's get it's Van Gogh. It's Koch. I don't care if there's a better pronunciation. I can't do the <laughs> sound. Nice Van Gogh. Stanitz just resu bed for 81 months. Thank you for booing. That's the noise like a zombie makes when it first wakes up. Exactly. Like yeah. a zombie reveal. That's the Dutch language in a nutshell. Yeah. Like. So Pretty a much. bunch of bloody zombies stirring over. They it. do just choking over their words. <laughs> They're still awake. Should normalize the pronunciation as. Cock. I mean, if if the if the if the zombie apocalypse started in in the Netherlands, we'd be fucked. Yeah, they were like would know? Emperor Tall. And um, also, half the people there that are stoned out of their gourd 
Who would know yeah. that they were zombies or people? You'd have to kill Radiant them. Plague in his Amsterdam enjoying friends. Yeah. That's, that'd be it. that'd be a, a big a big blow to houses played in yeah. terms of zombie. I'm sure you could manage. Yeah, I think it'd be fine. The wealthiest yeah. zombie that ever lived. <laughs> <laughs> Starting early tonight. This is normally game two type of stuff. He's, he's just, he just he stumbles it. around. Gold, yeah. gold. <laughs> Do you reckon he'd also have a zombie butler with him? <laughs> Get his brains, Jeeves. Butler Jeeves. <laughs> <clears throat> if we get another way early plague, we'll bosh it all in game one. Yo, yeah, I, I like that. And then carry on in it's game just, two. It's and just three. shaking up the formula a bit. I like, you know, it's innovation. Let's talk football. Kai Havertz, Havertz to Arsenal. Your thoughts, plague? Uh, I'm quite curious that someone in chat is actually prompting you for football chat already. I think they're just just Jay Kane. I'm curious about the evidence if Kane should leave for Bayern. Yeah, yeah, came for buying for a reported seventy million euros, and they turned it down. which is which is quite funny because I reckon for in I reckon here in the UK he'd go for like fucking one ten or something yeah, silly. Yeah. Do you think the Turkish airline CEO uses Reddit? Nice and job, saw the post series interview. Oh. For 101 months. Quinn has been shafted whilst flying out to Bali. He's been flying for 50 hours because his plane was overbooked. Quinn! Uh, Airy, Quinn? CC and C. Oh Quinn and Callahan. That's a disaster. Um, so he went to Turkey yeah, and then no, uh, Turkey there. Yeah, they probably had one of the He flew on Turkish Airlines. Um, Overbooking flights is one of the most brain dead things I've ever seen. Good old five flights, 50 plus hour travel time due to overbooking. Nice one, Turkish Airlines. Goodness. Oh no, it got worse, says she. I mean, it is, it is insane. Dire team pick. I did like Celery's tweet saying this will be the first good sleep I have in forever because normally Quinn whispers subliminal messages to me as we <laughs> go to sleep. Nice jump, Alistair. Looks Zephyr just resu bed for 43 months. 10 seconds remaining. Ah, uh, Witch Doctor. Not a hero I don't I don't Five believe I saw Witch Doctor in the major. Are you are you are you remote talenting barley? No, I'm not doing you, any barley, not mate. Getting... No, not doing any barley. I uh, wasn't invited. I've never been invited to anything in Southeast Asia other than TI in Singapore, which doesn't count. So I've never done anything in that neck of the woods. None of the Manila oh. majors, Gen Genting, all that stuff. Never done that. I mean, they know how sick you get when you get over there, so maybe they're just sparing you. I don't know. I didn't get sick in Singapore. I was one of the people that didn't. Oh, that's true. And I didn't feels get... like usually you come back with something. Yeah, normally I, I come back with something, but uh, my my, uh, my my endurance is enough to get me through the event more often than not. I'm trying to think of occasions I have been sick. There was a Dream League many Ten years ago remaining. where we were staying at the Globen, which is a really dog shit hotel, Five and me and Blitz went out for dinner one night, and we had the exact same thing. And then and that evening, I had the most uncontrollable shitting vomiting Radiant it was awful bad. and i wow. messaged him i was like i'm so ill i went out i had seafood chowder i feel terrible and will was like <laughs> the next day he was like i don't want to i don't want to like Diet fuck you over bad. but i had the exact same thing as you i was like what so the issue was the beer because he didn't drink beer i had a Radiant pint of beer they were like oh yeah, it's from like a local brewery blah 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 and I'm, oh. sure, I'm sure that there was something wrong with the beer Something wrong with the... And the ladder just, like, pissed in it or something. Something. Yeah. He was it's uh, flavoured with the essence of shit. Yeah, it's shit flavoured. But, it, yeah, it was like something in the pipes Ten was bad, something. Remaining. But, yeah, it was really, really, really bad. I, I, I thought I was going to die. Seconds remaining. I had to hobble out and buy some Swedish cracker breads to eat the next day because I was just stuck in my hotel room. I couldn't keep anything down. It was really bad. All the fake Dota lovers are watching Alliance versus Nigma. All the real Dota lovers are here watching the real pros. Now, hang on a sec. Isn't this a if Nigma win, they go through, and if they don't, if Nigma win, they go through, and Alliance lose, they they drop out of Div two. Out of Div two. Which would be hilarious if it happens. Good God. Like, just I can't imagine a funnier thing than the Alliance <laughs> dropping out of Div Dying two. That is <laughs> desperate. Let me see. I'm gonna have to tune in. See a bit. Nice of this. jump, Alistair. Nick yeah, put up on the second monitor. Just as you bed for 88 months, Alliance washed. Where is it? Where is where is the stream for it? They put me PGL. <sighs> Nobody's watching it. Remaining. 
Ten K people are watching. Four K viewing. Uh, yeah. Twelve K are watching Gorg. Well, he's watching Enigma vs. Alliance, so... Yeah. PGL Dev, 5k viewers. So he's got over two times as many viewers. Desperate stuff. <laughs> so, Enigma Galaxy vs. Alliance. There's a guy... How many of Medusa and Edge? Uh, I don't know. Alliance have managed to get... Techies, Shadow Demon, and Pango, which are all popular. Should we, should we just cast that game instead? It's really <laughs> tempting. <laughs> this is this is how we enter into the pro scene casting. Place. This is our time. We'll be the next Rob and Roll. Yeah. I don't know any of these alliance players. I know S four. Oh, is he still on alliance? Yes. 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 Chuan, Chuan, I do recognize the name. I recognize Chiam. Did you guys see the game they made us play, where we had to name players on teams? Like Sheep's question was like, name an off laner, and I was like, oh fuck! Like without a list, me and Kev were like, shit! Without a list of the player names. Well, I, I saw that. I saw the game where you had to. It was like an Seven, item build. And you had to name the hero and the player. Yeah. And she was like, just think, like, of, think of a post four, and I'm like, Ugh. it was, it was, it was, it was desperate at times. But that's, I mean, I wouldn't have done any better. But I'm just saying. But I did at, finish. You're on the panel, buddy. At that point, you're approaching like equivalent chess grandmaster stuff. You know where they have interviews? They like they show them yeah. this image of a game. It's like, ah, oh, yes, that was. Uh, no, this was from that, that tournament. Carlson, though, uh, a, a, this was that tournament, and B, or sometimes all they had to do was name a mid. And I was like, I was running through the mids that I guaranteed knew was were in the tournament. I was like, oh fuck. <laughs> oh, I do wonder if, if like pros can uh, have the same level as of recall as chess players. I guess it's really just not that important. No, but um, I don't know. Really kind of I don't know if it'd be the same, but I think they could definitely take a stab at it. Because they don't they have do the. Watch. I mean, because the patch changes like. Yeah, but they they don't... So the game changes every half patch. a year. So what's the point of remembering the fact that you picked? tied against this other dude before and it worked out that's true but it was on like they they, they do pub against each other a lot and they do study each other's builds a lot they have good recall they remember games but they don't have the communication to say this is what happened in that game they're like yeah i think we like played top a bit and it was probably kind of wrong and that's how they always talk about past games yeah like could we say like yeah i think we should maybe you know uh maybe the agency gone on that guy but it's kind of like wishy-washy you know it could have gone either way you know that's just how the game is so that's how they all talk about pro games yeah um so i know handskin and i know ponlo i don't know charlie and i i don't think i've ever worked an event where Ch Ch Yuan was playing maybe i have but i don't remember it their record is two wins and four losses goodness me so is nigma galaxy still the same team um, uh, yeah, I, I don't know if they, I, they, isn't Miracle still like on a break or is he back? Miracle, I, d I don't know. I thought he stood in for someone. I don't watch Div Two. Yeah, he's, he's, he stood in for for Shopify, mate. Yeah. But I don't. I guess like Div Two stuff was wasn't really happening. I don't know. Ten seconds. I don't know, but I last I heard he was was on a break, but that was like three months ago. So. Five seconds uh. remaining. Interesting. Oh, they got Mikey. Miracle is out for the year and Sumail left. They're just collecting that fat Saudi stack. Who? I don't even know if it's Saudi. Which which country is it? Which? The the Big Nigma's rough. based. Uh, I don't know. Honestly I have no idea. Well, Mars, good heavens. Alliance does have PL. This is interesting. So they have GH, Yuma, Mikey, Kuroki, and MC. I don't know Yuma. Mikey's a baller. Love Mikey. Mikey is a bit of a baller. Old type. But as as we discussed to death in Dojo Pro Circuit, literally only offlane matters. Mm. Uh, there's not a, nothing else matters. Just your pause three player. Is that is that why we were losing that yesterday? Because I was playing offlane. Yeah, exactly. It's it's literally. I don't know. I how do I keep ending up in the off lane? I don't know. I don't you're, just, be you're, not, there. you're not brave enough to just do what the others do and well, just no, because, confidently because be wrong about where you can play. Well, no, because if you have Greg in the stack, he wants to play pos one or he wants yeah. to play mid. 
I have Munt in the stack, he wants to play mid. And then we have Luke in the stack, he wants to play pos 4. So now I'm just left with pos 5 and pos 3. And inevitably, there's going to be like some some guy who only plays pos 5. Um, or rorts, where it's just it's just purely beneficial to have rorts on pos 5. Um, and then I'm left with pos 3. Ten seconds. Uh, it's 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 my punishment for for not being firm enough. I think. But I we think were. <laughs> as Nanesh points out, the, the the critical error here is having Luke in the stack. The lad is a, a walking L machine. If there, if he a, had it. Uh, his two perfect... games he's playing well recently, so it's going to be another ten games of dog shit. Yeah, yeah. But, the, but the problem is, is I think he's either baked out of his mind, uh, which is my first instinct, um, or he's just trolling. And I suspect it's a mixture of the two. Five seconds remaining. Yeah, you know, Especially, why not both? You know what? Sometimes he'll just not say a word for the entire game. And you think, this lad is is away with the fairies one way or the other. Uh, but yeah, SGG threw out like a rogue comment. When was the last time a major winning or TI team winning team didn't have their offlaner absolutely like carry them? And it's really hard to think of a team that their star player was not the offlaner that won. I mean, it's, like, it's I think just so important now, isn't it? Ace, I think, arguably the strongest player, like, the strongest core, at least, on, on game, and they play for Ace. Um, if he has Collapse, a bad game, absolutely carried TI really 10. 3-3, three, three, absolutely carried TI 11. Seen Zai carry Liquid a bunch of times. Yeah. Um, and then going further back, it's like... Universe. Actually, no. Samael probably carried. There's a name you forget in there, Blake. <sighs> Good old Saberlight. He really carries shot for every time. That's true. Yeah, he's dog shit. He's, he's the best. He is not uh, dog shit. Saberlight is definitely not dog shit. <laughs> I've seen his Enigma gameplay, brother. Right, you can do but that I, now. I've seen his Enigma <laughs> gameplay. Sometimes it's Pog, sometimes it's dog, but he just makes it work. I respect it because he's he's making those fuck ups on the big stage, and he's coming back and picking the same hero next game. I respect that. The thing is, Clamity Stam, you say that, but a lot of the pros think Seb was the best player on OG. Like, by far. I mean, I think Anna was probably... Anna and Topson were... I think, I think Anna... Actually, Anna I scratched that. I think Jerax. That... Jerax probably made the most... They were all, they all pretty quality. It's kind of hard to, yeah. to nail in on one. I think, was, Seb was, was, I think Seb was, was thoroughly underrated. Though. He was, yeah. I think people just thought he was just, like, a chap who was there for, like, team spirit. But he fucking, like... Knocked it out of the park every game he was in, and then when he came back to standard or whatever, pos five, just just like domey fools, like yeah, he, he, did. Uh, he just made everyone look like a fucking bunch of clowns. Yeah, which was great. <sighs> yeah, it is. Uh, it is funny. I think I think it's because pos three requires a combination of so many factors. First of all, you have to be willing to bite the bullet and take the least favorable core role like it's probably they're going to try to shut you down it's going to be a hard lane you're in the off lane you also have to make things happen your team looks to you for tempo you have to get a lot of boring items sometimes you have to shut down their carry like a lot of the game rests on your shoulders as the three and yet you are third in terms of importance of farm so you have to achieve this with less you were also in the worst lane to play in because, you know, you might be up against a really objectionable carry and support matchup and it might just be awful. You have to pick your your hero sometimes into the enemy team being able to pick a direct counter. It's very hard. And yeah, that is that is the most true thing you've ever you've ever said, Ted mate. <laughs> it's I think it's that's all... rough in the pod three. You it's, need to go in, that's all true. You need to build pubs. all the fucking items. That's all you need true to... for pubs. Well, in the pro scene, it's the exact opposite, right? In the pro scene, they're first picking mids and pos ones, and like they're preserving like some beastmaster for late picks and pos three. Right, in pro however, games, however, they like, exclusively stack those two that. fucking ancient camps for the pos three. You never see a middle yeah, or that, they, that's why they do that. They do that because they know they're gonna have a shit time. Like the no, thing they is, fucking have fantastic times. No, they, they do that because having the pos three be the most farmed here in the map is so like easy to achieve now. Yeah, but that's only because of these fucking stupid camps they've got everywhere. And I mean, Vanguard. It'd be silly They're not like to make They're like all the a... strongest laners in the game now. Right, but they took away so much. Iron Talent, Stout Shield, gone. It was a long time before they brought anything back. You used to be able to be in this yeah, lane. Yeah, a long time is, a long alone, time is true. Play. You used to be able to be there alone. Yes. 
And then Ten they were like, fucking years fuck ago, the fifteen frame. years ago. Fuck the offline. We're talking about fucking now. We're gonna make Post it harder easy. and harder and harder. It's not easy. Fuck you. I want to see your Pos three, mate. Let's fucking uh, see it. Uh, fucking let's do it. Let's yeah, do it. it. I want to see Plague Posy three. Bro, Pos three is harder than Pos one in pubs. Maybe not pro scene. It's miserable being in the Pos three unless like you either commit to not being useful to your team and just being like, well, you know, I thought someone else was building the pipe, or uh, you have to just sacrifice your your entire game. You're gonna chuck yourself in and start fights and shit. It's like being the midfielder with a shit defense behind you and, a, and an attack that can't score goals. That's pause three. Yeah. Mid midfield general with no troops. Let's have a look at and, the, and it, the it, it feels it like in, in some games, it feels like at the same time, you have to carry the game on your back. Mm -hmm. But the other, the, on the on the opposite side, it feels like you can't do anything. Yeah. Because you have no fucking items that are yep. useful for you. It's brutal. So we've got Jacus, aka Jacus.8kplague underscore teach me. Is that. Oh. It kind of that... looks like Chad Dendy. That, that is Chad Dendy. Where's it's hilarious. Chad Dendy? This sticker mid. Where did, where'd that come from? Oh. Holy shit. It's hilarious. No, I think that's actually just what a Dendy looks like. <laughs> you did Sublime that. Squelching on the Pangoon. Then we've got Clavs on the Lion. A hero that saw a decent amount of play, actually, at uh, a Dream League. People were, were picking this hero. Magnus, Be not right. picked once. I was kind of surprised. They were like, oh, yeah, well, they nerfed uh, in power. Like, yeah, they... He only... He, his, basically, three of his spells are fucking... Actually, no, two of his spells are absolutely useless. RP is not yeah. that good, and his Q is terrible. So all he has is in power and skewer. Uh, and if in power's good, it kind of works. If in power's bad... It's not worth it. Other offloaders do the same for, for less pain. Axe, another hero we saw occasionally. I don't think he won a lot, but it was there. Didn't see Hoodwink. Yeah, Axe think, think was pretty <clears throat> good, to be honest. I like right. Axe. I think his Axe is, is very underrated. I really like yeah. the, the, the reduced cooldown part of it. You just make able to play so much faster. Three seconds. I'm also yes. becoming a big fan of Arcane Blink. I'd like to build more Arcane Blinks. The extra range no, is lower. Expensive as fuck. It's, it's so hard to get if, to, yeah. if, you're, if you're playing, like... I either have to be really late game or be no, relying on your team stuff. heavily to build like, more useful items. Because, uh, I don't know, it's, it, you're spending 4,000 gold just to be able to bank twice as often. Yeah, I guess it's great, but... Further. Yeah, and further. It does, it does, there's, there's a lot of times where I think if only we could reach that a little bit further, it would make a big difference to the way mm. we're able to take new flights. More than if we blinked and slowed them a bit. Genuinely. Oh! Oh, Stobby is in here. <clears throat> Stobby. But at the same time, he's giving you pretty much no stats that are useful to you. I, I know. If you're a universal hero, like, if I could have got a Windrunner, the oh, stats I see, are useful. I, think, I thought we were talking about Axe. I mean, no, I I was just talking in general because I think about initiators, but I think on oh, Axe okay, it's no, okay. I mean, but fine. no, on, on like universal like initiators, like Magnus, I think it could be really sick. I, uh, I know that Stobby is back. Stobby, a Mecha Bellum enjoyer. I saw that he'd installed yeah. it. Popped up on my. They are screen. slowly spreading. It is his kind of game. I did. Um, I did play it quite a bit in Sweden because I was. I was unable to play Dota a lot of the time. I'd come back at like midnight. It's pretty tired. I thought I'd just play a bit of Bellum. I'm up to three thousand combat power now. I've been playing quite a lot of the game. God. Beat a lad this you still afternoon. do the Overlord cheese, or have you got no, 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 given no, no, up no. on that? Yeah, I mean it's still time sprint, but um, it depends on what you what you've got really. Yeah. I think um, I'm 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 enjoying it. I am enjoying it. Winston having trouble here. A couple, maybe one more click. Yeah. Yep. Winston Fast down. Master drawing it. Vidicus on the Bloodseeker. Saw Bloodseeker a fair bit. Uh, yeah, he's. I think he's. I wasn't convinced. He's just quite a good matchup against a lot of heroes. I think that's it. It's literally. I mean, most the pro dota at the moment, yeah. by the way, in my opinion, is extremely fucking boring. And there were not many good games. Hardly yeah, no, any I don't, comebacks. I don't like it very much. Hardly any comebacks. Uh, if you win a fight, that you know you can just plod around and methodically. It's all very win methodical. You just you just crack your wards down, go take Roche. And also the the fiver between the teams. People talk about the different characters of all the teams. It's not really that different. They're all still picking the yeah. same heroes and pretty much playing the same way. It's just kind of sucked a lot of the fun out of it for me, in all honesty. When we watched the grand finals, I was thinking that. Technically, it's a five-game series. That looks like it's close. Right. Every single game was a stomp. Yeah. 
Yeah. Just there, there's something off about the heroes that are good at the moment that just mean the draft is all that matters. Like you, you, you get the draft, you win the lane, and then the game is basically over. If you win like yeah. more lanes than your opponent, it feels like the game is just over. And everybody does this thing, like it, it's very uniform. All these very incredibly scary. strong and tanky offlaners, they're just a bit too oppressive, you know. It, it, I can't, no, no, you know they're no, so no, easy real. to play as well, you know. It's, it's just it's just too much. Nice job, it shouldn't be the case. Jamie you can just pick Brood Mother offlaner. Like, well, they got the Brood, that's it, game months. over. It's like, it's just, yeah. it just kind of feels silly. Where did Brood? I swear Brood was not a hero this entire tournament, and then the final, she was suddenly uh, pickable. No, they, picked, that... her, they picked her a lot. She was very contested. Right, I just missed those games. I, maybe I just don't watch Brood playing teams. I don't watch scum. Um, Who's the scum? I missed the win. Any, any brood pickers, clear scum. Nice jump. Uh, it was funny. There was a morphling and a. Um, oh, this is yeah. Clavs is dead. It was no a... morphling five though. No one. No, no one. No, no one. No. I really it. pushed it. I really pushed it. <laughs> Didn't Mavoshka give it a bit of thought? Yeah. yeah, yeah no, he, he was, was like, he was oh, I can kind of see where you're coming from, but but he was actually he did something that most of them don't. He was like. Huh. Like, you could tell he's a captain, because he's yeah. always looking for that kind of shit. This wasn't yeah. it. Clearly, this wasn't it. But <laughs> you could see him thinking, like, he was actually trying to theory craft it. And I, I respected that. I appreciated that. And uh, I know that by the end of the uh, the run nice of me job, trying to push Alistair. it, this yeah. Tsunami, when I said my friend, you know, Ashwin, he's like, I know months. who Ashwin is. <laughs> 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 he knows, he knows. Yeah, it was oh, maybe dear. long. Uh, the, the, I don't know if you saw the clip, but they 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 talked about it without you even being there. What did they talk about? They talk they they talked about Morphling Five in the draft and about how Ted's friend is always trying to push Morphling Five. <laughs> Sorry, dude. <laughs> no, it's great. I love that. Yeah, I thought it was really funny. I even saw some Morph Five lols in the chat. Oh, Jake! Jake's uh, Jake's murdered Winston here. Also this is actually the first the time I've talked about the game. Holy shit. It's taken six minutes. You were placed on and a courier kill. He's Ed. Sublime Scorching had a TP and had ult. So I, I have noticed, I, I was watching um, Quinn play Pango. Uh, and yeah. I, I, I think he definitely took a level in Lucky Shot by this point. I he did. Yeah. Sure. yeah. Blake, Blake, Blake mentioned that to me. We we're almost like getting excited that my, pan, my new Pango build is, is going to take off as well. Because he would use it to like... I mean, it's hard, you know, if they start trading with you, you might be able to stop them. And, and also, it, sometimes you can fuck them up getting last hits under the tower and stuff. No, I didn't... He was... Uh, the, the game I saw him take it, I really didn't understand it. Because playing against a fucking Primal Beast. Right. A hero that when he's trading it, yeah. with you, by definition, doesn't give a shit if you lucky shot him. Yeah, yeah. Um, so I'm sure there's some very big race stuff going to it. I just think... It feels much more consistent to have 440 than 411. But I don't know, maybe there's something to it. Maybe there's something to Lucky Shot I haven't seen yet. I don't, Ashwin, I don't believe your 404 is no, going to sweep the No, the 404 was, 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 is a bit, it's a bit pushing it. It's, pushing it's a it bit up. too far. You know? the, 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 entire, the, entire, the entire theory is is that Swashbuckle does so much more damage than, mm. yeah. than Shield Crash. The Shield like, Crash probably was like over at least 50, at least 50% more. But that if was because you, have, you like, used just, to just uh, attack Shield Crash, What's it fucking called? Yeah, you, you did. Um, so <laughs> one, one, thing, one thing I, uh, I found interesting was when the uh, Morphling stole webs from uh, Brood, uh, they just stay. Oh! oh! What a fucking play! Sublime! Sublime! Yeah. And he gets the rune! Um, Perfect. You can lay webs as Morph Brood, or Mood, or Brof, depending on how you want to put it. Brof. Um, but they fucking stick around for fucking ever. Like, it was so. Abundant. Oh, well, the, the, the webs stay around. Yeah. They were just there. So, so, like, 90% of the map was web. And you couldn't tell which was which from looking at. Them. Oh, so Brood didn't know whose webs. It was just you just running around. I mean, so Brood's just putting webs all over the place every time they're running because like it could be mine, could be theirs. Wish Doctor has oh, gone. That's annoying. Two cask, three maledict. I mean, people don't take the heal. Like, I think. I think that. I think that's. Paragon. I'm. I'm. I'm sure that's unintentional. What? Not taking the heal or? No, the, oh, the web the, thing. The breed web thing. I mean, it, the, the the whole idea that this hero can steal your spells is so stupid. Uh, it, it, it's. it's I, I, there, there are there are some things that just don't carry over. I guess there's just not many, very many permanent pictures you can make on the map. Nice Because yeah. you can't you can't even steal techies, techies mines. Right. 
Um, and I, what else is there? What else is there? You can, put, you can, I don't even know what you can put on the map. I don't think there's anything. No, I think it's no. webs, and that's it. But uh, yeah, I think as, sh as soon as um, morph morphs back into morph, if you like. Yeah, he should. Everything just they just should, should all go. But I, I also just think that the hero is silly. It is very silly, and I'm I'm thoroughly enjoying it. <laughs> I, I, I I indeed was playing it before it was it indeed? was played a lot, and I don't think it changed at all from when I was playing it and when it became Pog. I think people were just like, Munt, you're on the wrong morph, account." Whatever. <laughs> buff, buff, morph, to be honest. <laughs> Munt, you're on the wrong account. <laughs> Why'd you tell him? That's fucking hysterical. TBH is Munt. That is TBH. Japanese <laughs> Ruffle indeed. The, these are the only two messages that ESLs have ever posted in this chat. <laughs> and yeah, I've worked for them many times over the years. Never oh. swing by! They never, 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 swing never by. turn up. Never turn up. It will uh, VIP ESL, obviously. Well, if Morph does get a uh, buff in the next uh, patch, you can blame it on ESL right here. Clip it and ship it. I mean, the amount of crying that's been done about Morph, I reckon it's it, it it's gonna get it's gonna get hammered. I just don't yeah. I don't want them to hammer. Okay, here's here's an idea, Plague. What if they hammer the bits that make him a good core? But they don't hammer the bits that make him. And a good he comes core. back in as a support. Yeah. Pushes him in as a four. <laughs> now he's a four. Yeah. And then the posh is like, yes, uh, we're picking more five from now on. <laughs> so great in lane, has some fantastic abilities. The, the thing is, the, the lane has been genuinely quite impressive because he just hits them. It's like playing against an undying in a weird way. No matter what you do, this guy still has more health than you. And that's kind of easy to play with. It's easy to play those lanes, but then there's a point after lane. There is a mid game, you have a mid -game your issue. Items, where he's yeah. fucking useless. It's not. Like it's not. It's not even the. It's not even the item situation. It's. It's level fifteen. Yeah. Level level fifteen. You get That's plus sixteen the, the, the seconds more. Right. Yeah. Which is which is real real good, but it's level fifteen. So. That was nice from the. There's there's brain. just a period be between those two levels, six and fifteen. Where it's tough. Oh the. I think there's a there's a world where we treat it like a bat rider support. We give it some bomb priority and like level priority, and see what happens so one of the things that I, I i i think quinn talked about this or i saw him saying on stream the ability to pull heroes or pull creeps like that you can just train them off around the map i i think i agree with him it's stupid um and one of the dullest things like i saw was people would pick axe and just creep cut you just grab the creeps you just walk off back to your tower it's really fucking boring, and I hate it. Uh, he is not ruptured, so I don't know what Vidicus did rupture, but it certainly wasn't uh, Axe. I think it was a creep. Can you even rupture creep creeps? Rupture. You can, right? You can yeah, rupture yeah. creeps. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But but I spank myself. Was not sure, so he stood still. <laughs> well, you wouldn't want to risk it if you're in the heat of battle. You know, you hear the rupture Alex noise. Died. I guess that's the death blade on Pango. Jake, He's you... not gone for a goddamn. Jake, that was corrosion. fucking appalling. If what, he what's... builds, the thing is, I was I thought that he wasn't going corrosion on Pango. And corrosion Pango is absolutely cool. It's so fucking important. Uh, but I was going to give him benefit of the doubt, thinking this guy's being smart. There's a Medusa in this game. If he gets a really fast defusal. Yeah, and shuts true. her down and goes back for corrosion. That's a really good build. But I think he's just forgotten about the item, sadly. So my 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 kindness of giving him credit was was wasted. Mm. If he does walk back bot right now, or just try, if he just tries to follow Medusa around the map, he's a very good player. If that's all he does for the rest of the game is follow Medusa around, Medusa's make sure she's following him around now. That's yeah, that's weird. But if he doesn't <laughs> back off here, just goes and annoys it, right? Just drain her mana. Uh, it's, he's going to force lots of rotations. Oh. He's going to force people to babysit. What 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 do you think about the man to Pango? The Considering man to Pango. He's, he's a universal hero, and it's good with he's in trouble for Axe, but he's very big. Boom! That's dog. But Axe is tanky as hell, but they can't. They, that's, that's, that's a finger kill. He is so. That's a finger kill. Just do tanky. it, mate. Yagi Yaga! There's a bongo, bounces off, Winston's in trouble. There's no mana on. Poor Jake. Maladic. Now there's even less mana, and there's going to be some breaths coming in. This is oh. trouble here for Jake. 
He I actually... can breathe on him. Why would you not breathe on him? Because oh, Winston is a goob! Winston. And they're still gonna get the kill. Oh no, he got mad up! Oh, so oh, oh. oh, hello, 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 hello. Oh no! Oh, the double! Paragon, you can't run into the ice! How do you miss stunned targets with Ludwig Gold? Be terrible. I think. I don't know what happened there, but. Uh, it's bad. I think when the bushwhack ran out. I have missed like, him! I can't the name believe of the Foxy it! Just resubbed for 23 months. In us. Thanks for saving us from the horror of game 1 ability draft. Oh, don't worry, there'll be no ability draft on my watch. I'll just, I'll just, I'll just stream whatever, whatever these lads have. <laughs> Always eager for content. Do 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 be do do. Is under attack. Radiant's bottom tower is under attack. Oh uh, yeah, I was gonna say the uh, the lion mana drain has, has kind of come into its own recently, uh, as as a spell. Suddenly. Because of Medusa and this new strat of just pumping up your own heroes with uh, with mana and sucking theirs, this mana drain is no fucking joke. It actually got Jake killed in that last fight. Mm -hmm. um, even the Lich, the tiny amount of mana drain that Lich's E does, actually kind of looks quite good when it's against Medusa. It does a lot of mana drain. Mm. Not in this game, unfortunately, but it's, it's something to be to be aware of. I, I love this new new Lich against like <laughs> against your, your summoners in lane. Your Beastmasters, and you just, techies, you, just, you just you just suck the fucking ball, and the ball just vanishes. It's great. Really? Yeah. The 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 suck on Lich now does like fucking like three thousand damage a second to to units or something like oh, that. Oh wow! I can't remember how much it is. I think it's like two hundred damage a second. Just something silly. Jesus! I spank myself. I'm gonna nice sing that again. Job, Alistair. Solidly like, just a resub bed for 74 months. If it's, if it's cast on the creep, it deals 250 damage per second. I suck myself, I uh, spank myself. Oh, oh what? Oh, what? What? That's a sniping what? bullet. Oh, Jake got a bit distracted by other things there. Yeah, Jake's just a bit of a goon, isn't he? I'm oh, sorry, lads. I was distracted for a minute by something else. What if my I kids do. need to feed him? One of my 12 kids is hungry. Oh, I'm going to get him. <laughs> Get some nuggets on. Ooh. Trouble here for someone. Don't know who. No one. Uh, what impact is Stobby gonna have this game? My prediction is none. I do oh. think the mag impact has has been. I do you know what? Ma we we've always been shit at mag. We can't we can't win with it. It doesn't matter if the hero is OP. When the hero is OP, we were still losing all the yeah. time. True. We well, at mag and so the goons. So just, we just, we just we are. Mag. We are quite selfish players, and so the idea of traipsing around the map, empowering your other two cores, it only happens when it's convenient to the mag player, right? Yeah. And if you're a mid mag, that's fine. You're farming a lot yourself. But if you're a post mag, it's like, it's kind of missing the point of why the hero was good. Because when we played with, with oh, they were fight coming. Oh, it's a good call. Yeah. It's oh, a pretty good roll. Yeah, one more spin. Oh, why has he gone in? I don't know. Why did he go in? He just suicided himself. Here comes Vedicus. Oh, oh Vedicus is moving like a, a steam train here. Like a bat out of hell. Yeah. Like a bat out of hell, I'm going in mode again. All trouble here for Paragoon, presumably. Heaven's up and down, bong, gong, gong. Bonk, bonk, bonk. So Blime Squatching is, is having a pretty decent game here. a goodie. Yeah. Medusa, however, is the clock by which all time pieces must be set in this game. People just aren't that concerned about Medusa anymore. I, I feel she's a, a solved hero. I, I like this not all that. Yeah, but compared to Morph, yeah, she really well, doesn't. Morph it's, like, it's like, you know, it's like scale of disasters, you know? I'm sure if, if Medusa was still the top dog, I'd be terrified of her. Perhaps. But I know what a top dog hero actually looks like now. It looks like fucking Morphling. Yeah, it's so Suddenly, scary. Medusa seems like a like nothing in comparison. So my, Try my to problem kill is, you know that when they patch it, they're going to they're gonna under-tune him to fuck. He's just going to be garbage. 
yeah. then there are, there is a huge list of heroes that are just not worth picking in Dota. And they're going to do something about it. Because a lot of iconic heroes that Dota is just not able to have at the moment. That I find it, it's very frustrating. But here's, here's something I I've, I've, I think about a lot, right? I think Lich is the most power creeped hero in the game at the moment. And I just came up because Asher was talking about him being able to kill, like, creep and stuff like that as well. They have just steadily over the years given Lich more and more tools. Lich until has suddenly a he's lot like, of shit. Suddenly like, he's he like, the part of Exit 4. Uh, I think that's bad game design, in a way. Like, why does Lich also need to be able to kill Beastmaster Balls? Someone like, because then what's, what's the point of killing someone that can already do it? Why would you ever pick CM if Lich can do it as well? Yeah. CM's better. Um, oh, wow. No, actually, was... actually, Lich is the best support in this. Apart from Undying, maybe. I think the best support at the moment. Didn't His see, frost oh, shield didn't more see him that much. much. I think we saw him a lot. No, not, not really. No, was, the, was, people picked him as a counter to the techies. It... Like, the whole point, of, the reason they're picking him is because you can suck techies out of his jump. And then he can't just bomb the carry. That was when we saw oh, him a lot. Oh, oh, Woo! He dodged the finger. He I did think. dodge the finger. Somehow. Well, this is nice from Paragoon. There's an RP on two. This is a classic stop maneuver. Turning up after everything's led to done, and now he's gonna die. So he had, he had 37 games, and the most picked hero had oh, 84. Yeah. Uno, Zeta or Zeta so it's not in one picked every game, but still, not reasonably a lot more than CM. Yeah. I will yeah. say that much. Yeah, CM is just a, a dead hero, it seems. Which it's is weird because she was really strong, and then of course, as usual, a hero is doing well. So rather than Turn, turn it down a little bit, they're like, right, fuck that, and fuck that, and hit that by 50%. It's like, can you just, just a little bit at a time, and buff the other heroes up a little bit, and then you can pick basically whatever you fancy, but instead, it's always over-tuning and then massively turning down heroes. It's very frustrating. But that, that's my thing about Morph, like, there, there wasn't a particularly obvious change you made that, that made him, like, the hero in the pro scene. Right, People but they're gonna like, dumpster Oh, shit! Him. Like, you know they're gonna dumpster him. Oh, I know. I'm. I'm not looking forward to it. But all the what they should be like. For example, take a hero like PA, just unpickable, right? There's a whole bunch of heroes that are just unpickable in the process. What do they do to PA? Well, what apparently she's just in the bin. Like she's just used. Like there's there's a lot there's a lot of things oh, where no. I'm like, like what someone's just like yeah, this hero is garbage. I'm like why? Like, what? Uh, what? Uh, laning, uh, uh, laning, which was her weakest point. It's always laning. Is is too weak to be worth picking the hero for what she does, right? It's always shit like they can't lane, they can't farm quick enough. End of story. And they've added more tools to deal with evasion. So you know, why would you ever want to pick PA? I mean, for example, she until she gets nice Battle Fury, job, which is quite a long haul, trattino, she's not farming, and against a team that's any good, you compare her to Medusa, who can just split shot, doesn't need to worry about getting a Battle Fury, job done, and is then useful. It's like, you could just, just pick something else that lanes well and comes online faster. Like, a lot of these heroes just suffer from that. Yeah, and and potentially a lot of a lot of heroes have suffered from the BKB nerf, right? I feel like BKB was like an item that enabled any hero to kind of do their thing. Which yeah. melee carries like a, a, bit, so popular. a bit garbage. Jug, face is void because of the counter into wind Right, right. and and uh, morph in, into some regards. Yeah, I suppose sometimes he is a melee carry, and then I think Terrorblade was picked occasionally, and Bloodseeker is like the the big one as. That's your good jog of the two big medical. But so there's just a whole bunch of carries that you just cannot pick. Like yep. you will see people pick Slark, that's true, Slark. You will see people pick Ursa from time to time. And it's like I, I just feel like every carry should have a place. But a lot of the time they just you just can't pick them. You just can't. It's like, no, you can't pick a two weekend lane. Yeah, if ever, for every hero to have a place, they've got to remove a lot of things from some heroes, right? So like, I, I think Techies has Immense magic damage, stun, disarm, and slow. Yeah. You gotta get rid of at least two of those and give them to some other heroes. Or and then just, you have... just bring the values down a bit. Like, it's not that. It's surely not that difficult to make the hero feel like, yeah, he's annoying. I think... But it's deal. Every hero should essentially be playable. And it, it, I honestly think if you just adjust the damages a little bit, you would notice something. But at the moment, Techie's output, damage output is insane. I love it. I mean, it's fun to play, but it is nuts.
Right, what is what is actually happening in this game? I'm just watching Medusa Network creep up slowly, and it's it's concerning to me. So she's got the butterfly done. So oh. It's kind of her peak. So the lion, by the way, the the girth, the increased girth on his spike, is apparently what made him pickable. Not the not the uh, the manner. Spike radius. But it was the the spike. It made it made it was hard, what, what, harder to miss. What, what to does that mean? Who who said that? I, I, all all the analysts I talked to were like, "Yeah, it's this Earth spike." I was like, "Really? Not the mana sun?" I was like, "No." I mean, it's like situationally, it's nice. Don't get me wrong. I I, I get how it, it makes it makes a difference. But so the line was this. like was like categorically the worst fucking right. hero in the game. Yeah, and then the, what? That, so two, that twenty five more radius is like yeah. Well, this fucking guy needs to yeah, know. Like sudden, no, not enough, but suddenly he's pickable. Like, here's the thing, if you think about it, we think about things you can get at 20 minutes as being a reason to pick a hero, but all they do is pick heroes that are good in lane. Because as we saw in the grand final, if the lane doesn't go well for you, the game is over. More often than not. That's the that's the problem they've got to solve. The conundrum they had to solve is, first of all, it has to be possible to not win your lanes and still win the game. And second of all, the comebacks have to be a thing. But the money that you get... Oh, Lord. Oh, this is big. Are they even going to get the thing? Uh, someone might. It's going to be close. Die again. Oh, Cloud's got it. This is a messy one. Yeah, can they I get Vinicus? They're going to get Jake. Get two. Stop, he's what trying to do stop things doing? here. I don't know, he's just I standing there. I think he RP'd. There. He RP'd and dragged them in. Come on, no he's just giga chad sucking them. <laughs> yeah. Was it too far? Naps has had a good game. Uh... This this Magnus is still still yet yet to be. I, all I'm saying is that a... with the map of this size, I think rather than telling like they didn't want to encourage people to just farm because then Dota is really boring. And if you have a huge map and it's more worth it to farm than fight, people will just farm. But they tuned up the money you get from killing people so much that as people were pointing out a lot, it doesn't matter how mid goes. You just have to get a kill on your rotation, and it's like it never happened. It's like the lane was even, or won by you. So you have to pick these mids that can rotate, and and or a very specific counter, and then you just go and rotate, get a kill, and it's like the lane didn't happen. It's just it's just crazy. That's why um, a lot of people saying Bet Boom was so effective was Ooh, the way they played Dota just minimized any chance to kill them. Like you'd see a lot of games where it's like two kills on the enemy team and the enemy team would be farming and they'd still be the same farm as Bet Boot but they would just never get kills. Yeah. Oh, big, big call. call. Why is Medusa not hitting? Dude. Fucking hell. It's Alex. Some astonishing cowardice and it's still one fight regardless. What was Alex doing? Running away? <laughs> he, he got silenced and just started running slowly backwards after his axe hit the biggest three-man call of your fucking life. Just click him, dude. You're a right clicker. Just give him some clicks. Click the enemies, lads. Please, lads, click the enemies. <laughs> I'm just squeezing the last of the wine out of my wine bag. Feels like wine being a medical bag. procedure. You don't get wine in a bag? No. It's inside a box, but it's in a bag in a box. A um, box of wine. You've never bought a box of wine. You've never seen a I've bought a box of wine, but it's a crate, it's not a box. So it, this is a cardboard box. Right. With a little tap. Yeah. But inside okay. the box, it's a bag. But this is this is not something I've done. So no. you can take the bag out. I, mean, of I haven't the box. done it. I've seen it. I don't think you really particularly see them that much in shops here. They're probably about. You've never been to Waitrose or MS or. Tesco's yeah, I mean they're they're, they're about, but you Sainsbury's know, the, the, or the, 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 the uh, I have never frequency seen of them compared to regular box boxes. wine. So it's a box of wine. It'll it'll be like a box of yes. Right, but inside that box, it is a plastic bag. I, I get that. No, get we the, understand the that. Then. We're just saying they're pretty uncommon. No, yeah. they're very common. I'd say I'd say they're much less common than a bottle. Oh God, yeah, of course. But I mean, it's much. So so, so that 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 they therefore makes them fairly uncommon. No, I don't think so. I'm not, I'm not saying they're like finding gold. No, but I, I, I don't think that makes them uncommon. I, I would say... in the world of, in the scene of wine. Right, but that's because it's almost all bottles. I'm oh, just this, saying... is the, this is the stupidest argument I got no, into this not. week. 
<laughs> See, I don't think it's uncommon to see a box of wine. Maybe it's just a Twickenham thing. No, it's it's not. No, it's. I don't think. I I, I don't think that is, is the case. It's like they're sold right alongside the bottles. Like happen. it's right there. There'll be bottles and boxes. Yeah, the wine is shit, but it's a box. It's like two and a half bottles of wine in a box. Anyway, when he gets low, it stops coming out. So you have to take the box apart and and squeeze the bag to get the last of the drops out. Hmm. Ooh. Boxed wine had a Super Bowl ad a few years ago. It's a pretty big thing, says Laughing Puck. I mean, the other thing is, is, and this is what people don't tell you, is that you can take the bag out of the box and just wear it under your shirt. For example, to a sporting event, if you wanted to sneak in a bag of wine, wear it as a belly, and then bang, you've got a bag of wine on you. Shove it in a boot. Put it in a handbag. Are scanning. I do like Oval Cricket. It's a it's a bring your own booze place now. That's it's a it's a I think it's a it's something the rest of the the sporting world should adopt. It's much nicer. What? Well, so you can still buy your own there? No, you can bring your own in. But you can't buy it. You can buy it as well. Right. So but the point can, is they're you encouraging can, you can bring your bring, own like, booze. Oh, that's yeah. Fantastic. You can bring bring your own uh, alcohol. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Smoke, lad. Smoke. You're all grouped up. Oh, I really thought they were gonna smoke. The goon smokes are my favourite. My favourite is when they're all five in one place. They very clearly have just done something, like the Tormentor, and they say, let's smoke and look for a gank. I'm like, they know where you are, lads. I don't get this. Why did... Who... Someone keeps insisting we smoke after Roche, and we play them every now and then. I keep thinking, what the fuck do you mean, smoke after Roche? They know where we are! Right, they know exactly <laughs> where we are. We've they could, just if they wanted to, they could I, I think, think to the one, second one thing how, that you how don't far we can get across the map. To, to, that, to that argument, play, because I agree with you. In a pro game, Absolutely. But there is going to be one guy who's just standing there, <laughs> farming away, like, especially if they're on division, like, they do not care that we took Roche. They're like, oh, we took, they took Roche? Lovely, I can go farm some more. And then we catch him out and play for 26 months. Big balls win games. What? 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 I spike myself still chasing. Dax finds someone here. He's gonna find Clav. Surely Ooh, no. Good no play way. Wow. Okay, someone said at the start of this game, "Oh shit, Clavs is finally allowed to play support. He's gonna redeem himself." Uh, and it's actually yeah, been... he's, re he's redeeming himself. It's actually been true. His core is famously hilariously bad. Yeah. But he is fucking owning this game. He's still losing. They are losing. <laughs> he is still losing. He is still losing because the Medusa effect is fault. strong. It's probably it's probably something on Vindicus, guys. Don't yeah, know. this and these ruptured creeps. It's also well, on you're it's saying that. Done you're saying that. If you look at net worth, there's a glaring problem at the bottom of the table that is not Clav's fault. It is Stob. Stob's magnus being it's, less it's farmed. It's Stob. Well, he doesn't he didn't go for the echo save, really which uh, I find pretty interesting. He's now going refresher. Yeah, he, don't, he, doesn't he, he doesn't know the bill. Six hundred mana. He doesn't know the bill. That's no matter at all. What the fuck is he doing? What, what, I, I get Storm hasn't played much, but... It's, it, this is tempting to use one of our interventions here. <laughs> no, I mean, just let him do it. Yeah, we've, we've, we've gone to a more sort of conservationist approach, you know. We don't intervene anymore. Yeah. We let nature have its way. So, exactly. the refresher costs 350 mana. Yeah, His no, ult costs 225. Enough, he has enough. To he hardly only has, has enough for all he, of his fucking skills. He doesn't skills. have enough Once. to refresh and cast. He has bought no mana items. <laughs> this is intriguing. I wonder if he's going to figure it out. Maybe he's hoping that while he's while the enemy's RP, Clavs will suck mana into him. Tell you the other thing I've 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 I felt from programs, which I always do is. They uh they would rather just pick a hero that's whole job is to save than build save items. Oh yeah, and th that and Pavise. We never build Pavise anymore. We had a brief phase on the ranked grind where we built Pavises and we won a lot, and now we're we're, we're no longer Pavise gamers. And I don't nerd know why. Nerd shit. That's why. It well, is nerd shit. I don't know. I just not really playing the heroes that are building one. Yeah, our supports are just not Pavise Pavise boys. I do I do it on clock. Love it on clock. Here's a here's a poll. Is boxed wine 
uncommon. 92% say no. I'm not, I, I didn't mean it. I, I've got my words wrong. I don't mean it's like fucking, like, like finding some secret temple in the jungle. The word you used, mean sir, that, was but, uncommon. Bottom line, yeah, I meant relatively speaking. We're, we're talking Einstein here. It, the, the bottles are more common than the boxes. It's a non-statement. Well, there you go. This entire fucking podcast. You know, well, you talk about wine who you like, mate, but there's more water than wine, isn't there? So. Well, exactly. So I'll, I'll have a nice, ridiculous. a nice uh, glass of the Sauvignon water. Please. Makes no sense. I believe is the point the chat is rightly attempting to make. You're saying chat is right. That's I am, a dangerous. I am giving part. chat a, a yes on this one. They are correct. Dyer's middle tower is under well, I don't know about chat. I don't know about chat. I'd say that only the the d d gen middle class will buy boxes of wine. <laughs> True. Of which I consider myself. A I've just never bought wine in general, to be honest. Big wine. I, fan. I had a when I was at uni, I had a, a wine subscription that sent me. <laughs> that uh, you, at paid, uni, you paid into. At uni, poor students paid, take note. You paid into it it's like twenty five pounds <laughs> oh, a month, enjoy. and it would go into like a, a wallet, basically. And then you get massive discounts on big crates of wine, which was just fantastic. I mean, if fair enough, like because uh, I was getting I... like two hundred and fifty pounds of wine for like a hundred and ten quid. Alex, uh, press R. Alex. <laughs> Chat is outraged. Chat is outraged. What? Outraged at your. I wasn't alone wine. in this. Your my, wine fucking, my, my nursing student friend was the one who said we should do it. So I don't know why this is going on as a tour. I say, Blake, shall we buy a subscription to Wine Monthly? <laughs> Why don't you? Spoke, you, that like a you, you have actually spoken yeah. to Charlotte, I believe it or not, in yeah. an in-house. Oh yeah. <laughs> she said, no, what jolly fun. Everybody plays different different characters in this I know, game. she fucking, she loved it. Oh, uh, that is good. I mean, I, you know, fair enough, isn't it? 100, 110 a month. Whatever. Eri says, when I was eating, eat I was eating stewed steak pie filling out of the tin with a spoon. Constant, yeah, that's, that's, that's my choice, Eri, the... not, not buy fucking money. You we could have subscribed back with the to a pie absolute monthly. correct choice in the comment below. What was it? It was an. I was a nursing student. The it was a nursing student. Makes sense. makes sense. Oh yeah, no, exactly. I, I remember an article I saw saying, if you spend less than ten pounds on a bottle of wine. Are you really supporting vineyards? Question mark. And I'm like, <laughs> no, I'm just getting hammered for a fiver. I mean, there's a really funny bit in Black Books where he says, "Here I am, smoking uh, really cheap cigarettes with a three-pound bottle of wine I bought from the corner shop," and I just think to myself, "This is fantastic." <laughs> <laughs> Nuckin says, I grew up on a vineyard. Shout out to Nutborn Vineyard. Nutborn. <laughs> What's Sounds like it's ingredient? made from nut. Nut juice. Yeah. We promise to nut Just in every cask. Just before bottling, we all line up. Every cask is nutted in by our staff of arch nutters. <laughs> is this why he's nutkin if he was born on Nutborn? Oh, very good. We're all nutkin. We are all nutkin, that's true. Mrs. Nutkin should be called Wombkin. That way we've got nutkin and Wombkin. Oh. Get it in there. Get both sides of the. Is that what you say to your wife? Yeah. Get <laughs> oh, it in no, there. That's that's what she'd say to you, really. Actually, get it in there. <laughs> well, it depends on the evening plague, of course. True, actually, I won't. I won't pass judgment. No judgment. Christ says Ari. They can't call it nut milk, so they rebranded it nut wine. Possibly. Well, they call it nut butter, don't they? They do. So isn't there a product yeah, called nut butter? Nut butter. Yeah. So I feel like they, they could get away with nut milk. If that's doing that's nut churned butter. nut milk, which is... That's true, actually. <laughs> yeah. Wombkin. I know this is, again, first of all, but I've lost the fucking the remote control for my fan, and I can't fucking find the thing. And I'm bloody boiling. Wait, is Charlie PT? Is that Mrs. Nutkin? Yeah. Oh, hello. <laughs> so you at Cindy's wedding? That's <laughs> 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 the way the way you said that was so funny. <laughs> 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 so you at Cindy's wedding? Hello. 
trouble there! Oh, this is trouble. That's an RP of, of sorts. It's not bad. There comes a skewer. They're all in the uh, the old pyre, which is an Oh, but this is not cool, though! Oh, it's fucking close. Oh, my God. He's just regening so much mana. All these snakes. I think this is it. This is this is a bit of a Medusa. Right? There's no denying it. Game one over by nine o'clock. Let's go. We're on schedule. Oh. Well, this is on stop. I'm gonna say it. I think that's pretty easy call to make. He is going harpoon finally though. So someone someone's got onto his case. Did we get onto his case? Did we use the intervention? We didn't, did we? No. You told me not to. But this no, I do we like we the uh, axe anymore. first secure. He's built an echo saber now. Yeah. But it's too late. The final final moments of the game. He can't be this poor. He so is not only is he dog shit, but he's also stream sniping. Who is? And so that's an LP. Oh, stop. stop. <laughs> Right. It's so a deadly own. Yes, Storm. There's a pyre, it's a big old pyre. I spanked myself. Might well perish here. I this, is the, this is the Axe pyre. It's, it's gonna it's do some damage. It is called it. I say they called it. They have called it. It's over. Right. Stop with the old blink and freeze. It's a classic move. Good old stomp. Beep, 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 beep. Is it still reading out subscriptions? I didn't hear the TTS. I might just not be listening. Why is Eri in a it's voice a public channel? holiday in Italy, mate. Is it? No one's hey, working. Hey, I'm on holiday. Speaking of, I'll tune into Dono Clips inbox. Thank you, Elliot Trent. I don't think I'm anybody sends them. Tune into the Alliance Enigma game. I'm just just tuning in now. Ah, yes. It's 20 Alliance to 16. Nigma with a 12k gold lead up by four kills. Yes. And they take taken mid Alliance losing. I, don't, I, I, I did set up a dono clip message that was meant to play every 25 minutes, but I haven't seen it. What, in chat or? What yeah. was that? <laughs> I've not seen it, it's it meant either. To pop it up and say, no, it's meant to pop up and say blah 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 dono clips, but I, I, I haven't seen it. If anybody's seen it, let me know, but it, it should be just like the bot just saying every 25 minutes directing people to dono clips, but it has appeared, says Jonas. Well, keep your eye out. Next time you see it, let me know. Well, Stezzy shit is take it. Congrats. Was Stezzy even in that stack? No. no. <laughs> people He's hate the, the Bali Major. People oh, hate the Bali thing. Major background. I think it's yeah, really no, nice. I... I, I fucking. What do you mean? That's nice. I think it's very pretty. I mean, it's, I I've gotten a bit more used to it, but it, it's still an, an assault. I think the color scheme is beautiful. I love the look of it with the the waves nice and the, jump, the, the, the yellow. I love it. Yeah, yeah, but the way everything's for the yellow. Yeah, yeah everything's for the yellow. Great. Yes. What's the yellow for? It's just the blob of yellow. Sand, mate. Ironically, it's, it's yeah. And if they made it look more like sand as opposed to like fucking, I don't know what that is. It's but sand. It, it's not anything. How's that sand? Because when have sand you seen sand? Sand is yellow. Water isn't yeah, blue. Yellow. Where's your issue with not that? Not fucking American cheese. Water isn't blue. Oh, I will also point out, nice having job, been to Alistair. Bali, the beaches Gate are not yellow. Just so the sand should actually months. be black. Just saying. Well, I would love that. Yeah, well, yeah, I would love to be able to read what's Stannis happening in my, water in my text channels. But... Water isn't blue. Pour yourself a glass of water. What colour is it? Nice jump, Alistair. Baron, I just resubbed for 15 months. Grazie for I think, yes, the issue that people have is that the colors clash with the uh, background. If they moved it down a bit so the very bottom was yellow, I don't think people would have a problem. So yeah. you had more of the upper part and less of the yellow. But I do really like it. I think it's very pretty. I think it's great, apart from the yellow. I, got, I, I don't know. I think if I looked at it outside the Dirt 2 client, I'd be like, that looks fantastic. Yeah. But all I can see is the bit that I want to see is not visible. <laughs> Someone do a Photoshop of this with Ted's dome, replacing the yellow and call it the Baldy Major. Well, why don't you do it, well, do it? Do it. Do it. The the Ted's dome in place of the Dota logo. I think that's better. Right in the center. 
the Bali, the, the Baldy Major and just my face looking so down and saying, oh, I quite like that them. yellow. Um, Plague, <laughs> are you in the lobby? Uh, I've not been invited to the lobby, I believe. Right. Nice one, Harry, mate. Well done, Harry, mate. Here, here we go. This is for you, mate. A slow clap for Harry. Oh! He raided with a raid from Harry, views. my boy. Can't wait to come down again, son. Give you a big hug. My boy Barry. Love that dog of yours. I don't know. The, does anyone know the name of Harry's dog? I'm sure someone in chat does. Nice jump, Alistair. Sto B149, just resu bed for well, 85 months. Grazie. Sono pessimo a Dota. Grazie. Let me tell you, that, that is one of the cutest dogs I've ever seen. And I showed the picture to Mrs. F. She wanted a Dachshund, um, or a, and, and I talked her into getting uh, Aggie. And I showed her the picture. She said, we could have had that. And I was like, you're next to our dog. And she looked at her and she was like, oh, I do love you. Like, apologize. But all she could see <laughs> was Harry's beautiful dog and was just like, fuck, we could have had that dog. It's like the most photogenic dog. Big eyes, little nose, looks so sweet. I felt bad for Aggie. And then I discovered that she had chewed part of our new sofa cover. Uh, so immediately retracted my, my love for Aggie again. So uh, the reason I didn't get a Dachshund is because my mate had one and he said they can be a bit nippy uh, and they can be a bit off with kids. And I was like, okay, fair enough. They do uh, They do seem like the, the brand of small dog that, that might they give get, you they get a bit pissy. Yeah. Uh, I mean, obviously it varies. Like, there are definitely... some small dogs that are chill. Yeah. You know those small dogs where like, like they're just out in public causing a ruckus. And everyone is just giving them some side eye. <laughs> I mean, I, I absolutely am not saying that every one of these these Dachshunds is going to be a pain in the ass. I'm just saying no. my mate had one, and he was like, "Look, obviously, you know, you, you could be lucky or anything, but you, you never know." I'm just going to block all of these fucking Bitcoin twats on Twitter all the time. It's Bitcoin what twats. They, what are they doing to you? They add you to some uh, Bitcoin airdrop um, list. Oh, I see. Yeah. Or they'll just message you with a, <laughs> a screed of bollocks about Bitcoin. So I just have to block them. <laughs> or it'll be, it'll be. Here's the weird one. There'll be some. I'll get a message from some some uh, some hot woman will like one of my three year old oh, tweets. Oh yeah. But a three year old tweet, and you look, and I'm just like, of course, this is a bot. And it's like, I want to fuck now. And there's like a, a bit, a bit dot ly <laughs> link. And I was like, oh. fucking hell. Why a three year old twin? The, the other side of that is, is actually a woman who wants to fuck now and you've just turned it down. I just turned it down. I had to turn it down. It's Mrs. F on her Twitter account. This is, this is Irimatio after Five your tweet, remaining. which was, which was a pretty strange tweet. So I don't know what, I don't know why people Radiant didn't get that tweet. I cannot believe that that exists as a page on Wikipedia. And I was like, this no, is I, fucking I, wild. No, I, I don't particularly know either. It was, it's just, you know. But so uh, several people are like, why did he post that? It's like, do you not find that fascinating that this exists on Wikipedia? It would be like if the dictionary seconds, had maybe. that as a page and for some reason they had a fucking picture for that word. Seconds, You'd be like, maybe. why? Why you of need, all you the need a demonstration, mate. I just thought it was bizarre and just so funny. Um, it looked it looked like a fucking picture from WikiHow. Right, exactly. You know, you, you know that website. Like it had everything. Yes, of course, it had everything about it was funny, and people just didn't get it. I was like, all right, whatever. I found it funny. I thought it was pretty pretty. I, I thought it was amusing that, that the link just had that photo in it. Right. Yeah. Like, yeah. I was, I was like, yeah. That was the funniest part of it. That was funny. I don't know why. I guess it has a Latin name for the same reason that fellatio Ten does. The Romans invented minutes. words for yeah. all this shit. Five seconds remaining. I would like to know what they called it beforehand. The Egyptians probably called it like, uh, you know, would you like to uh, construct the pyramids tonight? Or, you know, some kind of innuendo. And the Romans were like, no, 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 we need a proper Latin word for this. Well, I mean, they all wrote in hieroglyphics, so it'd be like, do you, would you like to burn It's just that picture. Cat? Yeah, it could be that. <laughs> <laughs> all, the, all the modern day scholars are like puzzling over this symbol. <laughs> Do you think it represents 
virility or fertility? No, but it just just says she wants a number. <laughs> An Egyptian back in the day. Just... <laughs> 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 Look what I chiseled, mate. Look at that. <laughs> 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 Baz on holiday back in ancient Egypt. <laughs> you got the Baz clip. Remaining. Oh yeah, it, is, it was it was it was spawned from the the last in houses that we did together. Muera. Muera. Partner, partner, Sapongo, please. Wait, do they disappear? Oh no, they don't. Uh, no, they don't. You can favorite them as well. So I favorite the one about which Ashwin's saying. Breaking news chat is wrong. I added that to your favourite just in case you ever need to use <laughs> it again. I'm going to favourite all of them. <laughs> Hopefully that means they don't disappear. Ten seconds What's this from, from Billy Big Balls? Is this a plague one? Five seconds remaining. No, I don't think it was. There was some guy who was like thanking you for subs. Oh yeah, like, there was, it was, it was actually a normal one and nice. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, he said, what did he say at the end? Baldy or something like that. Yeah, concerned... Egg. No, he said egg. egg. Egghead. Egghead. Con concerned chatter. Excuse me, Mr. Streamer. Concerned chatter here. Concerned chatter is one mine, I think. Uh, Alert yeah. to the terrible atrocity Sarah Beth has been committing as a mod in your chat. I think it would be best if she was unmodded in... <laughs> it cuts off. Was that intentional? No, I don't think it was. What was the cut off at the end? I can't remember what I'd said in it. I just... No, it, it. Wasn't, it wasn't intentional. I just ran out of fucking time. Oh, <laughs> I got across most of what I wanted to say, I think. Mm. The very first one, which was a terrible Scottish accent, was also me. I don't think people realised it was me. <laughs> there, was, there was actually confused about that one. Oh, I, don't even, I didn't even see that one. It was at the very start of it. Is this the one that's just Lamau? Uh, yeah, I think so. Alright, let's have a listen. I'll play it to stream. It's so bad. But I was like, let's just see how this goes. Hello! I, I don't think your stream is very good. It's, it's just a bit shite. Yes, that's terrible. It's terrible, isn't it? I, mean, I was like... <laughs> it was a good test of the system. Holy shit, what are you doing? I don't know, I just kind of went with it. Oh, hello! Oh, hello! <laughs> I, just, I don't know why I thought that was funny, but I really... Uh, just, I'm just happy I did that. We've got a Pudge. Pudge we do have a Pudge. Sniper. They're picking all the most obnoxious heroes to play against. Yeah, now obviously... If, if Talking Goons have been paying attention to their tops and builds, they'll know that... Disperse a sniper. Disperse a first item sniper <laughs> is, the, is the way to go. Ah, bot rider. Here comes Veno. That's what talking goons have to pick. The most obnoxious heroes. Mrs. Doubtfire. It did sound like Mrs. Who, Doubtfire. Who, who is Joaquin Phoenix? Which player know. is this? Eri, who's Joaquin Phoenix? Seconds remaining. It might be... Um, What's his What's his name? Uh, the guy who won the the one v one mid competition nice back job, in the day. Fletcher Mitty just resubbed for the channel nine months. Oh, it's Reg. Reg. It's Reg. Reg, never mind. Thank you for the uh, sub, Fletch. Fletch MT, I believe, an in-house player. Yep, Fletch. Fletch big on the in-house. He's had a real stinker over the last couple of weeks. Yep. He, played, he played. He played last week when you weren't here, and it was like fucking awful. I was furious. Wacky Vince was very good in The Master, if you haven't seen that. It's a good movie. It's got Philip Seymour Hoffman in. It's sort of like an L. Ron Hubbard um, origin story, I guess is one way to put it. It's really, really, really good. Was it PTA? Let me have a look. Dire team pick. Yeah, it's Paul Thomas Anderson. Well worth watching. Amy nice Adams, also job, excellent Alistair. in it. I, want just for 21 months. I watched three billboards outside Miss, uh, Ebbing, Missouri, I think it is. Oh, that's an amazing film. Which is very good, yeah. Really enjoyed that. Amazing. Francis McDormand was so fucking good in that film. Holy shit. Uh, Brazil, that's a classic, Ari. An absolute classic. I loved that Five film. Five seconds remaining. I thought that uh, Gladiator was a bad movie. Um, I know this is an unpopular opinion, and for a lot of people it was a big deal. But I liked some of it, I hated other parts of it, and I thought the way it was shot was really fucking bizarre. Um, weird slow-mos and 
this Radiant weird sort of low low FPS um, for all the action, and I just thought the storyline was really boring. It was meant to be a return to epic movies, but it just didn't feel epic at all. It was like, it's all right. I mean, I don't know why people lose their minds about it. The script is totally forgettable. Uh, yeah, I, I just, I just didn't, didn't understand all the love for it. In all honesty, however, I did find out today that there is a the thing board game, and I'm going to talk to Lewis about it and see if we can, we can uh, play it because it looked really good. <laughs> when did it come out? It's out. I saw it in the comic shop today. Oh, I see. What is it? Is it a new thing? I don't know. I just, I only, I only saw it today. I'm not across board games. You know what I mean? I'm not. All mm. over it. I only play them when I'm down with the yogs. They have picked people. Isn't Joe Klein our like go-to board games contact, Ashwin? Yeah, quite possibly. What is uh, what's Joe Klein? There's, there's a, lot, a, lot, a lot of other nerds. What's he up to? No, what is he to you guys? What, what is he to board games? Uh, I don't know. He just has a lot of board games. Oh, okay. Yeah, he is a bit of a board he, game he runs, fanatic. Like, board games like, oh, okay. and shit. And okay. Just one of those lads. Yeah. Like, oh, you know, yeah. they have, like, three shelves dedicated to board yeah, games. Yeah, yeah, like Ben. I mean, it's just Mr. Mr. Board Game. Ten I get it. Ten seconds remaining. Five <laughs> seconds remaining. Master and Commander. Now, there's a fucking movie for you. If you haven't seen it, see it immediately. Plague, have you seen it? I don't think so. Oh. Oh! What a film. Well, it, it's based on a book series, right? A very long series of books. Um, it's about a British uh, man of war that's in the um, Pacific hunting a French vessel. That's the setup. And it's phenomenal. It's, it's one of the best historical recreations of the time. Um, all the acting is great. The cast is great. It's, it looks phenomenal. It's, it's wonderful. I absolutely fucking love it. Because I. Film. I absolutely love the Hornblower books. Well, mate, honestly, uh, not I'm, because, no, 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 not say because no they're say no more. You will love it. I'm sure I will. You will love. What it. I was gonna say is not not because they're actually fantastic books, because they are like my childhood. Right. So I'm always down for more parts. I'm telling you right now, that. watch it. It is so fucking good. I was looking at heroes that have names similar to other heroes' skills. Is there only Omni Knight and Omni Slash? Ooh. Hmm. Who else has yeah, fans? Of... I was looking at heroes that have names similar to. Oh, I see. I'm sure there's another <laughs> hero that has a f word phantom in one of their spells. I could be wrong. Well, there's fucking Phantom Strike sure Grim... from PA. And and she's a phantom. I guess right, right. That, that's my point. Is that she's already PA? So is there another? Oh, the if, fuck is yeah, I guess goes phantom. Through? No, no, no! You guys are thinking of spells that are the same. Phantom Wait, Rush, Grimstroke, yeah, Grimstroke, Phantom Grimstroke. Rush. Yeah, there you go. Grimstroke's, no, but um, that's what I was. Yeah, I mean, that's what I was talking about. I was going Phantom Lancer to Phantom. Yeah, yeah. Phantom Strike. Yeah. Um, I was thinking Revenge might have sort of Vengeful or Vengeance might be somewhere. Um, Shadow Wave and Shadow Demon. These are these are all like pretty pretty generic words. Is there anything spicy out there? There's nothing like Omni Knight and Omni Slash, which is a very good one. Yeah, that is a good one. Um. Man, well, of, Man of Void and Faceless Void and also Void Spirit. Chaos Meteor and Chaos Knight. Disruptor and Disruption. <laughs> Indeed. Um... There's Necromastery and Necrophos. True. True. All right, we're in the game anyway. Oh, Arc Lightning and Arc Warden. Mm-hmm, there you go. So Light. yes, there are. Yeah. There are several. Turns out it wasn't I was looking at making a team that confuses enemies when they make calls. Omni is down. No, Omni is alive. That type of thing. <laughs> I oh, I see. Okay. Shadow Razor, Shadow like, Shame. I feel like that, that could be like solved very quickly by just like looking up to the top of the screen and just, you know. Wait, Eri says... This is a startling development. Why? What's happened? I saw Larry duo queuing with KBJ yesterday, playing mid Dazzle. Oh my! I see. Mm. He is locked in on Dazzle currently, and Zalaper, I believe, is a plus four sniper player. And yeah, Larry has four branches, which is not... and it's a Dave Yognot Pudge. Should we discuss that part? Yet? And he has bottle queued up, and it is Dave Yognot Pudge, my god. <laughs> they so lost. What, what a treat. <laughs> Are we running the bet for Dave Yognot? Yes, yeah, running. Dave, Dave's getting 
four. I was going to say five, so... Play, go I'll go for, for the, the, the wild one for six. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Fucking screw me. That's well, fine. You could get a tasty one here, though. Is he going to land it? There's no way he is misses one Is he even going to throw it? Where is he going? Where is he going? Dave! Dave! He's just scared. Dave? What the Dave? fuck is Dave? in your brain, Dave? He must throw, throw one out here. He gets that. <laughs> I, I don't understand the brain of Dave at all. I, I really do not. What is his plan in any what circumstance? Is Just running about. They're gonna get. They're gonna get Nuck in here. That oh, here comes Dave. Dave. Here the comes slide. Dave. Yes, yes that's, that's one. Good. That's, that's one. one. That's one. <laughs> that's one. <laughs> my neighbours now. They're, they're my back door neighbours live. So there's now people living there. And they oh, so have it's no their, longer a Russian spot. No, they have they have their back doors open because it's hot, and I have my window open because it's hot. And here's me shouting, Dave, Dave, at the top of my voice. Yeah. I wonder what they'll make of it. They must be like, you know, his mate Dave is really struggling. Fucking hell. Who's this Dave bloke? Why is Fucking he such hell, a cunt? I'll hate him as well. <laughs> Alright, here's a question. When sure. you are ghost shrouded, yeah. Unable to attack or be attacked, but you can still take physical damage, which of course Shadow Wave is physical. So you can still be Shadow Waved, can't you? You just can't be right -waved. Yes, that's correct. I think. No. I mean, I, I think Dazzle's fun. I was shot down by my fellow analysts when I talked to them about it backstage. They were like, absolutely not. Dazzle's garbage, mate. I was like, I don't know. He seems all right. The, his, his bad juju is actually pretty pog. If you get items that have relatively low cooldowns, you can really spam them. Yeah, what is... Hmm. I wish Larry would use his Q to secure last hits. That would be good. I think the... I guess the problem with Dazzle is compared to every other save hero, his save is just not as good yeah it doesn't help people keep in the fight afterwards right it's like last resort final moments you might get one more spell off but they're nearly always going to die again afterwards yeah. compared to oracle or shadow demon or undying mm -hmm. uh who saves a lot more like present and in the moment and actually save people right before they get to the point where they're on the verge of death no you, you are completely right like the, the issue is that shallow grave is just not a very good spell yeah compared to like um, they, they're all these other saves when it, I mean, I'm sure when it was first added, they, they, I'm trying to think, Oracle wasn't in the game. Oracle wasn't. Bunkering wasn't in the game. The Grab Ally. Grab, Grab ally. ally! I think one thing that might actually prevent Dave from getting hooked here is he's playing Pos 3. He yeah. is having to focus on farm. I, I saw he missed another one whilst oh, we were chatting about okay. other things. I'm just watching mid, but yes, you're right. The focus should be on the butt lane. It's all right, I've got, a, I've got my camera locked in. I think if you are playing against a, a void, you should never try to harass them. In general, unless, yeah, unless kind you have of. a way to really lock them down. You, you just you need dots. Yeah, so you've got to have. You need dot. dots, and honestly, just cl just clicking him is a good way to do it because void's Q is insanely long cooldown, uh, and he hates using it for like three right clicks. So you do just kind of do what Zalp is doing, just fuck click him. He can't ever use it. But the uh, thing it's is, such I mean, a pain. It, it, it's just... Oh, good glimpse. That what? was, I don't know uh, what oh. that was. I don't know what that was. I think, do you think Dave was trying oh, to do the... Oh, and then he spotted Walked into his death. Dave is the fucking saboteur to end all saboteurs. Dave, Dave is I've never seen here. Dave play this bad. badly, possibly ever. There's a death. Well, just, I've, just been, uninstall. I, I've been playing, playing with Dave uninstall. recently. Have and Dave, Dave generally makes me want to uninstall notes. Dave, uh, Dave is the worst. A non-improver. with him is miserable. I, I, I like Dave, but laning with him is special. Yeah. Also, if you if you try and give him advice, he usually hits you back with sass, which I don't really appreciate. Yeah, no, I don't. I don't get that. Dave is not a moron. Dave is probably a brain surgeon. Most many of the games. No, I, 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 he's not like a little. You know, he he won't he won't take it from anyone. But no. unfortunately, he's in the position where he's dog shit. He, he, he is dog shit. He hasn't earned the right to not take it yeah. from anyone. Basically, I think uh, you know who else was into that category? A young cock wobble meister. We're, we're, he has got very, very aggressive. He's got Riley sassy. has people he will listen to and people he won't. And if you're in the won't yeah. list, he will not hear a word. Yeah. But if that you say true. to him, Riley, can you please cast your spell? How about you shut, shut the fuck up? Yeah. No, he actually, he's, he's quite, he's quite good with me. But 
but with with someone like Luke, for example, <laughs> which to Ernst, no, he doesn't deserve any respect anyway. Yeah, exactly. But like, even if Luke is saying something that is correct and Riley's doing it wrong, he just won't listen. True. That is a level two back. Trouble for Zala, potentially. Or maybe it's trouble for Alfredo. No, he's alright. Lack of clicks there. T tell you what, Ted, mate, you should have seen Stormy Eagle the other day. Was he, he good? He was like. He was like, like telling everyone to fuck off and everything. Like I'm used to Stormy Eagle just being like a nice, quiet chap. Yeah. Then he was like, he was like shouting at someone like about how shit they were. Who? I was like Jesus, what happened to Eagle? Well, to be fair, should we give a bit more context for this game, Ashwin? You did royally screw him. <laughs> like. Wait, what? Almost as hard as it's possible to screw someone else in the game, you managed it. How? Did I, what did I do? Is you don't remember this? Game? You were playing Enigma. He was playing Spectre. No, it wasn't. It wasn't that game. He, he wasn't shouting at me about that. He was shouting at someone else. He wasn't, but it did put him in a great mood. Let's be real. <laughs> he wow. was shouting. He was shouting before the rain. Hit. So let's he was, not get it twisted here. He was. There, he there was, was playing, shouting happening before the rain. He was playing Spectre, and Spectre. He wanted to go Radiance, and assuming that, of course, he'd be able to go Radiance, he started building it. Little did he realise that Ashwin on Pos3 Enigma had already bought and finished a full Radiance, <laughs> and he could. <laughs> he had to go an entirely different set of items instead, which I'm sure tilted him off the face of the earth. Mm. Uh, he, like, that was like 20 minutes in, he'd already been shouting his lane partner for minute one. Uh, it, it wouldn't have been 20 minutes in because you got the Radiance, and they're very oh, impressive, yeah. like 12 minutes. You got that shit fast. You got it before anyone had the chance to it's say, what I mean. sure. He, he, he won't get mad at me, he'll just be like, oh, whatever. But, yeah, but, take but it with, out on with some other individuals, he was real unimpressed. Like he was, he was like giving it to everyone, nice telling after. Luke how shit he was. Like, that's what I like to see. Like to see a bit, a bit of, bit of, bit of spice. He was, he was giving it to Thomas as well. Thomas was doing his classic like, like passive aggressive moan. Oh, dude, and, the most and, annoying thing and, in the universe. Uh, and, Who, who's uh, that? Eagle. Thomas. Oh. He always his 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 favorite thing is like, oh, I guess we're just not that strong, are we? Yeah, or he goes, um, oh, <laughs> uh, oh, I, I guess we don't want to win. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Thomas is a, bad to be on a losing team with. It's for, for true. Imagine a losing team with team Riley. He's very good at keeping momentum going. Luke, I'll give him that. Thomas. This is a stack that occurs fairly often, actually. <laughs> I mean, I will always get in a Luke, Riley, Thomas, probably Adam they, stack. They, I will yeah, get they in were, I mean, stack. the last time we played, it was hilarious. They go hard. We just, we just ran about the map shouting at each other, and we won. This, this PA is deep. I don't know yeah. what Madge was hoping to achieve with that. He's hoping to kill him, mate. Yeah, no, but it was more that he decided to blur whilst underneath nice back. Defender oh, 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 dude, what a player. Also, but he, what? he like he did the blur when Bat was literally on top of his hero model. I don't know if he knows how it works. Play, do you have a, do I, do you have a hook, a hook count? Yep, it's still just the one, one to get tied. That's it. I think we've been here to start lowering our expectations, boys. I wasn't expecting to be this bad. <laughs> uh, no, no. To be fair, he is posy three, so it's a bit different. He hasn't been chucking them. True. That is true. But there's been opportunities to chuck them. Where yeah, other post threes would have taken them. I don't know, know if you know, but Dave is fucking abysmal. This is he is pretty bad. Right, I'm gonna focus on Dave while I go grab a cider. I'll be back. Sure. Right, it's Dave cast time. I mean, the most impressive well, thing about Dave is just how few no, he CS he has. And here's another one. He misses that one. And, he's and missed that one. Third. It, it's now, just now Dave stack lining up. up for the the quad vector. Can he get? He gets that one. So that's pretty impressive work from Dave. That's one more last hit than he usually gets. Vanguard does work with Pudge. Yeah, you're meant to build Vanguard. Unfortunately, Dave has built Tranquils first, which is very strange for a Pudge free Pudge. But we don't ask questions of Dave. We just assume Dave knows what he's doing. Yep, I trust him absolutely. Trust him with my but, life. But definitely going Vanguard before anything else is, is correct. Now he's actually going for a bit of a room. He, he just likes being a pos form. Here we go, three. here we go. He's got, he's, it's a big hook here. <laughs> he does get the kill. That's plus one fleet. I don't even think it, I don't even think I should win. Because I might be closest, but no, like, this it's, is embarrassing. It's a, it's like, a null and void competition. This is not a victory. This is just like, the only everyone is a loser. Chat, Dave, us three. I guess Ice Frog. 
he's, he's being he's seen his hero being absolutely slaughtered out there on the field. Yeah, only 20 seconds to go to land, what, four more hooks for Ted to win? Four more hooks for, for, for Ted, three more for me and five more for Five me. more for me. I believe mm. in you, Dave. Get, get sending them. Oh, there we go. The end of the competition. I'm freed to watch people get CS. My favorite thing. Yeah. So Dave has 20 CS in so 10 minutes. It's pretty cool. And the pause for pause five techies has 10. Yeah. How's how's Larry Llama, the shit llama, doing in the mid lane? He's not doing particularly well. Also, no. he's getting diff blade, which is is real interesting. That is real interesting. I thought you maybe get like an Atos or something if you're going for this Universal Hero build. Uh, but uh, that's a yeah. Universal. Yep. Fucking hell. <laughs> You won't believe what happened, Ted, in the oh, last, no. what last happened? minute. Dave landed like three hooks in a row. <laughs> Did he really? Yeah. Oh yeah, it was incredible. No, he didn't. <laughs> you gave it away, Plague! What the hell? <laughs> oh, sorry, but Plague was... Oh yeah, it was incredible. <laughs> Tied on to the unconverted. Is it, is it it's a Thatcher's Gold, a big bottle, a big old unused tier one token on Tide. How long do we think Nutkin will just leave this chilling? Charlie, do not tell he's, he's him. Probably, he's probably just selecting right now because you get like the little table coming up. No, you... I don't think so. <laughs> nah. How much do you trust? Do you, do you guys have Dota Plus? I do. How much do you trust the uh, neutralizing suggestions it gives you? I, I always ignore it. Good. I think they're really like the worst part of Dota Plus by far. I don't know why they're always so bad. Well, he did. He did end up getting his neutral item. So, knocking on the fucking ball. Yeah. Always stream stuff. Charlie was like, "You forgot your neutral item, Watchers. Don't tell folks I'm stream starting." <laughs> First, just got six. Oh, oh my god, Knock is still alive. alive. No, he's dead. No, he's not. He's Magic's dead. in. He's, he's getting glimpsed away. There's a dead dazzle. I don't know how he's ended up saying that's a There's lovely a chrono one too. Can they get the PA as well? Probably they not. Hunt down, but I think she's away. Here comes Dave with the big hook. Ooh, oh, what's he doing? That's... What's he doing? That's the neat. That's deeper than Alfredo should have gone. That. What was... a what a play from Dave. By the way, the what rest of his team was just not fucking following him. He was hitting creeps, but that's a tip. That's a tip right there. I think it's a very deserved tip. I got, I got betrayed. betrayed. Now, do you think someone was saying, like, really loudly, get him, get him, get him? No. Do you think, then, how, what betrayal narrative could there be if the, no one was egging him on? None of his team followed him. <laughs> oh, there's a hook! And sadly, three minutes too late. I think Dave is in a little bit of trouble here. There's the glimpse. The so, does he still get the stack? He does. Even though it was from beyond the grave. No, he got he got the kill first. It says Reaper Scythe 2. Oh, now, that stack. Sorry, I thought you were talking about Fleep. No, he does, oh, he, does get, oh, yeah. he does get Scythes from beyond the grave. I was also yes. on the Fleep. fleep well, grave. My, whole, my, whole, my, whole, my whole brain is just Dave. It's all Dave. Yeah, he just can't can't stop watching his pudge just stroll all around the map. All I see is Dave. Dave all day. Middle of the land. Oh, alrighty. Hold on up. It's so hot in here, I've got to put the fan. Got to get yourself a north facing north facing room, lads. It's glorious here. I have been enjoying the garden. Has been good. Yeah, get a new house, mate. Simple. Gone saved us on. on when I was there. um, I was talking Radiant's to Suns fan tower, about air conditioning, attack. and he was appalled at the lack of air conditioning in Europe because, of course, he's an American. Um, and I tried to make the point. There's another hook from Dave that we just really don't need it. It's not a thing you need very often in Europe. Is AC? It's yeah. just, Oh. Not a thing. And then he said to me, what do you do at home? You must have AC, right? I was like, no, I don't have AC. Um, oh, shit. This is 
Um, I'm afraid I can get Epic Doom here. Um, so he said, well, what about when you're working? It? So you must have it in your room. I was like, we don't have AC in any room in the house. And I said, it gets pretty hot in my office. It's like, how hot do you think it gets? It's like in the heat of summer, if it's like a 25, 26 degree day or whatever, and we were doing the conversion, so he knew what I was talking about. I said, it easily gets above 30, 35 in my office. Easy. Like, I'll be sitting there just sweating. Because I've got Radiance Middle Tower, the two monitors, the PC, the mini fridge, the fucking printer, and there's no AC, and it's a box room at the top of the house. He was like, how do you live? No, like it's weird, a man who lives in Arizona can't handle the heat. British Shiwa just raised his for 37 months, Gies, 3 years, got married, had a kid, and still watching an egg on the internet. What a world we live in. Is that the deal? Humidity is the real killer, but there's no humidity in fucking Arizona. British Ewa says, geez, three years, got married, had a kid, and still watching an egg on the internet. Oh, thank you. I mean, I do, you know, every year Sydney says, I have AC, it's fantastic, you should get it, and I do get tempted. But I think unless I was working full time from this room, I don't mind if I'm a bit sweaty. I think it, I think it, it, it's anti it's anti British to get an AC. No, I agree. Uh, you know, you know we're 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 all in this together. I mean, obviously <laughs> not me because I got a North Facing room, but you guys are all in this together. Hang on, let me if, look you, at if you're map. if you're the guy who gets an AC, then you know you can't complain about oh it's bloody hot today, lads. Exactly, so, I'd so lose my, that connection to the world. My office is not North Facing. I would suggest it is North East Facing. So it's not far off. You do, you do get a bit, a bit of sun. Yeah, in the dawn, but the the main I just get thing... no sun all day. Oh it's yeah. Great. I mean, I, I think part of it is first of all, it's very optimistic of British people to get AC because it implies that we're going to have great summers. And traditionally, we have not had great summers. We've had like a, a couple of weeks of real scorching weather, and we complain, and and then it's just back to being twenty three kind of cloudy and maybe it rains like it, it seems silly to get ac because it's like how often am i really gonna need this that's my problem how often am i really gonna think oh without this ac we would have been dead because i've lived here for nearly 20 years and it's been hot plenty of times oh. over that time bleak come on what's going on why is no one doing anything no no bleak now decides to lasso him what the fuck is going what's on what's going on lads please spells Holy oh, that'll shit! Whatever, whatever. Crime as well. Oh my Stop god! All. He's, he's gonna get away. He's gonna get away. Oh, why would you hook him in? Oh, it's a lovely chrono. It's a good chrono. But David's gonna eat this fool. He ate a creep. He ate a creep. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I cast him so badly there. Dave is gonna eat this fool, and, and yet it was Dave was too much of a fool to eat that yeah. fool. Good old Dave. Do you think he didn't own up to it and no one noticed? And now you've called him out? Oh, I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, that was Star 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 that Star was, Star That star. was horse shit. That was horse shit. That was some horse shit. I find it interesting that horse shit is still a real go to phrase in America. That is horse shit. We don't really have as many horses over here, I guess, so. It's not a go-to phrase. We're, 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 big, we're big on bullshit. We say bollocks. That is bollocks, yeah. mate. We're more about bollocks than horseshit. We hate balls more than poo, is what it comes down to. Yeah, we're, really. We're, we're, we're big on dog shit as well. Yeah, dog shit. Love, love it, dog shit. I don't think anywhere is too hot on cat shit. Cats are not cat shit's not getting the respect it no, deserves. It's, it really does deserve more respect because it's horrendous. This is a, a little bit of a micro grab from Bleak, who promptly perishes. Stricken out middle tower is under a Yeah, have like a fucking status resist or something. I feel like these lassos are lasting no time at all. Or am I just not? So the Maybe duration you aren't is supposed two, to get level. It's 2.25 seconds, Plague. I, I wonder. 
if people even level it at level one or something, Maybe I don't know. I mean, yeah, I'm not I feel being like funny, every time it's he's all used these, last all these stuns that got nerfed. This is something that Sheep was complaining about, and I think was right, which is why the fuck have stuns been nerfed at the same time as status resistance? It makes no sense. Like status resistance That's is right. in the game. And yet, stuns have also been nerfed, so status resistance is even more potent than it would have been, because uh, when, you can make stuns a... nerfed as BKB was nerfed, no? No, no, but the, so here's the thing: the, the stuns being nerfed. Who gives a shit about BKB now? It's like it's okay. I mean, you're still immune, but you'll take some damage. But the point is, even with stage resistance, the the stuns that have already been lowered by BKB. Uh, but uh, because it, as a response to BKB nerf, and now even fucking worse because of stage resistance. But that was a good thing, I think. You think they that... wanted they wanted more builds to be viable and wanted more heroes to be viable. And their okay, way of doing so... that was nerfing BKB and nerfing stun so status resistance could be viable in longer games. But it does also mean that a lot of heroes like Morph can now have fucking free reign because you can't fucking ever lock them down. Like, this is why Void is, like, one of the scenes, or, or Silence, or whatever it is, are seen as heroes that can, like, maybe shut down Void, because if you jump him, you can get him stunned for, like, two seconds, and then you have to chain him. You all have to have stuns to chain him before he just gets strength shift off, and then he doesn't give a fuck. Like, I just think it, it's it's kind of silly. But was it better when every single core just built BKB no, but second I, I, item? Like I said, just fucking get BKB out the game, buddy. Get it out the game. But then you, you have gotta, to you nerf magic damage so and stuns. But then you can have status resistance. Resist. Like, was, it's got to be one or the other. Instead, you just nerfed everything. I, do, I, do, I, I don't know why the, 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 the BKB problem was a problem. But the game is probably shitter now. It is much worse now. That is way worse to watch now. I, I, I generally feel like the, 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 the giga change on BKB... Like BKB was the one thing keeping a lot of heroes in the game because you can build a BKB and you did and that now you, could now do you can shit. play the game. Like you had a window of opportunity. PA has no window of opportunity now. She doesn't fucking matter. She's out of the game. A lot of these heroes that relied on BKB for their window do not exist. It's like all right, well, we're gonna also we're gonna nerf stuns to make up for that. But it just it just that as a counter effect has also meant that a bunch of heroes whose whole thing was stuns yeah, just don't fucking just like matter. Completely fucked. Like they they they've changed something like massive. It feels it feels like you know it's like completely changed the game. A lot of spells are being cast here by the way. Yeah. Now he's jumped into the shop drop there, that's not great. Can they get Epic Doom here? That's a nice uh, I don't know what that is from Big Giant. Where's the Ravage? That is a great Ravage from what Napkin. What the fuck? So he wanted to I blink, believe his he blink was in shot. Yeah, he was in shot. Yeah. Oh my god. Go on, Dave, throw a hook, mate. Oh, he's already used it. I will... Okay. I agree to watch Dota is worse than last patch. But I think to play, I'm having a lot more fun because I feel like I can play around with item builds. And, and actually have to think about what item I build next. And there are different possibilities that just didn't exist when it was a BKB patch. What a glimmer from that. Oh, Dave. Dave, 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 Dave. Dave's abysmal, isn't he's he? so funny. <laughs> I feel like he's lagging more than usual or something. No, he just is just... not dismembering anyone. He's, very... he's lagging what we call it nowadays. Very bad hero. Yes. Very bad hero in a very bad player's hands. I don't know. I, ju I just think there's a lot of work to be done. We need to... Uh... We've got to unwind a lot of the shit that was done in the last couple of years, I think. Was yeah, I mean, there was place. never going to be a, an instant magic patch when they're changing this much, right? There's still yeah. a lot of kinks to, to work out. Which is why I'm surprised they, they're they, not they can being more aggressive with patching. They need, to, they need to change something up pretty big time. Who do you think's top of fantasy points? Don't don't cheat. Oh, top oh. of fantasy points? I'm going to okay. say that it is PA. I, no? can, I, can I ask... Oh, let's watch the fight first. They've got to grab him. They're going to try and kill PA. That's a nice chrono. Larry Lama isn't in position to grave. He's not. Oh my god, the yeah, match has gone further in. But Can they get him out? There's the grave. grave. Where's, Where's the grave? The... What the fuck? Larry! What is wrong with the lads? Yes, Dave. Well, it's a bit of an, an L fight. Um, is is fantasy points calculated based on what role they played in the game or what role Plague? 
just pick one. Dazzle. No. It's 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 fucking notch on disruptor. He is five one and ten actually. That does make a lot of but sense. But it's it's he that is. and also it's it values wards and shit. Techies is second, six and two, then PA who is seven and three, and then Void who is five and one. So Dyer's I think it it really really seven. values ward placement. Dyer's now I think when it comes to TI battle pass or not TI battle pass but a battle pass. Actually no fuck that. My conversation is useless. Our boss is gone. Yep. It's dead. Pass, BP's no, dead. No Fantasy, all that's gone. Fuck it. So long as there's Ag's lab, fuck the battle pass. Here's what I want to know. It Does that like mean it. the fantasy points are going to be removed permanently? Because who cares? What was the ravage for? Because Nutkin's dead. Just, just ravage And Dave so is still deep. alive. Nutkin dead. Right. It's all gone fucking wrong. <laughs> I love how offended you feel on their behalf. It was. What was he doing? You had one hero and you're ravaging. It's like a two second stun. What are you doing? I know, ra Ravage is like, it's got to be the easiest fucking ult, ult to, yeah. to, to manage. Tied to, to roll in the game is because Ravage is so easy to hit. You can yeah. get the pos 5 supports that save and the person you're trying to kill. That's his only reason Tide exists. He's like super tanky. You're not really going to get stopped from casting. You just have to wait till like some lads are about. I mean, I'm delighted to see PA winning a game. I fucking Radiant love <laughs> PA. But, uh, Anything can happen in Doom games. Stannis says we're I... going to fund TI then. It's a good question. I, d I do not have an answer I am, um, you know, I, I, I do... I speculate. I like the battle passes more than I care about any other content, though. I don't give a shit about any mini games or any of that crap more than just I like the skins looking so, nice. So, I, I think that they've realised that more people care about the battle pass and levels and unlocking cosmetics that way than they do about its tie into TI. And I think yeah. Valve have decided that they would rather do, say, two or three mini battle passes a year and keep money rolling in and keep people engaged by having, like, you know the way CSGO has seasons or whatever? Just have that. Just have, like, it's the summer battle pass, it's the autumn battle pass. But then they got to put the fucking effort in. Cause right, but they'll do that. In the that. last few years, the effort has not been put in. But imagine you can't if... Just make, you can't just make three shit battle passes so next week. So, what right. if there was a lot of money to be made in the battle passes? Then they might put the effort in because... It might hire someone. This is worth the force. Instead of just, like, sticking fucking Steve on it. That's a decent Good enough Once again, you get Dave, just Dave, that's a, a nice stun on the back from the Tetris. Match is gonna die. That's a grave. It happened. He's gonna get the life steal off. Oh, that's that was a closer fight than it looked. I'll say that. No, it was close, but a good grave on match. I just think unless. <sighs> okay, voids. I, there's something wrong with it. I don't quite know what because this is all very standard. Sorry. Faces voids. I, 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 this is exactly what you do as standard on Faces Void. No MKB, brother. That's it. But you need something to deal with PA. Yeah. And I wonder if you're supposed to go MKB instead of me on this. Yeah. Bob says, don't Google CS updates past five years, new case, that's it. It's true. But they also do, like, in a, in a similar way to Valve uh, Dota, they'll sort of dip in and out of doing something you think, oh, that's interesting. Well, they'll do, like, some new season or whatever, and then they sort of just don't bother doing it again. But they did presumably spend a lot of that time working on CS2 and I still have yet to understand why the system between CS and Dota is different because you feel like in a way I think the CS ecosystem is probably healthier for orgs and all the rest of it I'm, I'm, when I go to work for ESL, PGL or whoever it is I would say 80% of the people I work with don't know anything about Dota but can tell you everything there is to, to know about um, CS they all Sorry, work safe. Oh my god, he's so shit! Yeah, he's, he's having a fucking shocker. He didn't even fight do, for anything. I do greatly enjoy how frustrated Munt gets with the, the CS love though, because he keeps saying, please stop hiring the CS observers and get Dota ones for these Dota tournaments. And every single time, day one of an ESL tournament, the observing is dog shit, and they have to go and find observers out of nowhere. I that is know, greatly I entertaining. I don't know if that's true. Well, like, Bell uh, and Major, they didn't have CSGO observers. All I can say is, every time that ESL's tournament starts up with, like, the, the group stage first day, the observing has been horrific. I think that's because they have... So, 
and because they they hire in observers that are used for other games that don't know Dota 2, well, and then they I'd have, have to, to go ask, and find. I'd have to ask Munt, I don't know, but I, I I do know that when you've got say eight games going on at once or whatever, you're dipping into the non full time observing crew. But I don't think that means that they just grab random CS:GO people who don't know anything about Dota. No, no, they. Yeah, no, that is what they. Did. According to according to what Munt has said, that is what they they have done. Oh well. I don't know if that's true. Because it's like the, the team organising that is also not a Dota team. It's like their oh, events team who are also more CS. Yeah, oriented. they're all CS guys. Yeah. But it's like, so I I mean, CS is, is like much more widely um, uh, watched in terms of live events, I think, because they have so many more majors a year that, that are like super well attended, I think. Because they don't have like a DPC, do they? They don't have the equivalent. I don't know how it no, works. I don't think they, they have, have like a, a, a pro, Intel like Pro Tour or something like that, right? Um, which has like a circuit of their biggest tournaments. Uh, that, like, the official ones. But I don't think that's a foul thing. It's more like ESL's dream. Yeah. I, I, I mean, they obviously don't have a DPC because they don't have like a fucking TI. So. Yeah, exactly. But is it healthy to have a TI? Is it no. good to have a TI? I think it's no. bad to have a TI, genuinely. Um, I think if you have a system where all the money in the scene is weighted massively towards one event and all the money that goes into the game is weighted towards one event, I think it's bad. I think it, it means that you spend half the year working on that event. So let's say that Valve decides, and this is all speculation, to dip out of TI and say, right, we're done. We're not doing battle passes for it. We're not supporting it. Uh, the Saudis are obviously going to start doing the Riyadh Masters or whatever. We're done. You guys take over. What we're going to support or, or or encourage is, like, let's say they, they even got rid of the DPC or something like that. They just say, all right, it's up to you guys. Let oh, all the big, orcs it's handle it. Oh, it's Dave. Dave, it's Dave just, just chilling. Oh, the dark coming in from the back. Oh, it's Chrono. Oh, it's Chrono, but again, they're not going to be able to kill Phantom Assassin. I don't think they've killed anything. They killed nothing. Oh, they're going to kill it once. Uh... Oh my god, fucking plinking from the back. DAVE! Plink, plink. plink. Well, I'm gonna say he ain't getting away. Oh shit, uh, Mars fire, baby. Don't, don't think he is. Call it. So let's say that Valve gets rid of the DPC and stops doing TI. You have to rely on PGL and ESL and, say, WePlay or whoever else to fill the gaps. But instead of having one big event a year, you have multiple tournaments uh, with qualifying rounds and group stages and all the rest of it uh, during the year. Um, that That's probably what we'll end up with. And I think a lot of the teams that are now in Dota, I don't know how you would qualify. I don't know if there would be a Division 2 and DPC in qualification. I don't know how it's going to work. Maybe they just go back to how it was before when they were well, they in, just invited, invited you just teams invited and, teams. and like a fucking open quals and closed quals and yeah. I mean, honestly, like that. The, I think wildcards are some of the most hyped things in Dota. Why not combine Sniper with Pudge? And Sniper ults someone and then they're frozen and then Dave can't miss a hook. I'm just thinking out loud here, but that <laughs> could be a thing. Look, we have run a lot of games with Earthshaker and Pudge in them, and we never coordinate a fissure into a hook. So there's but no chance they're, they're coordinating. But we would do you it could. once and then be like, alright, hold on, let's just coordinate this. Like, we could. Yeah, but we never fucking do it. Even when we say, let's do it, we're always, someone just throws out. It's the worst thing about all our Marauder and Pudge players. They just oh, throw they out random hooks and random arrows. Hang on. Every time. Now, hold they on. never wait for a You start. even commented on how my good my Marauder was. Yes, you're, you are good at... You so are very good at heroes that poke and prod. And, but you know what you do? You build Atos. And you start it yourself. You cut, don't claim you wait for stunts to come in first. No. You're an Atos. Because I'm not going to rely on the lads. Exactly. And no one does. But we could. Uh, we yeah, would have we the could. coordination. We, we could, in theory, track roast times. And we never fucking do that either. It's been 10 years, Blake. <laughs> I will never track a roast timer. I even said out loud in one of the games recently, when Roche goes down, let's all alt ping the time and none of us do. <laughs> <laughs> do you know who does from time to time? Fucking Luke. I know. <laughs> we don't. His, his one saving grace. So, uh, Sa Samu312024 says, you want a more golf tennis tournament? I'm not saying what I would like. I'm just saying what I think is going to happen. I have. I was going to say, say that, that uh, golf, golf has shown... The sort of the, the possible Saudi playbook with with ESL. Yeah. 
have obviously come I think what they're know, doing is pretty hype. What it's is just it, a shame live, it's all to the do live with tournament? Is it live? Yeah, paying mass amounts to lure away some, some talent from the, the main golfing circuit, and then after pressuring them for a while, combine the two together, um, and your, your sports washing is complete. So maybe maybe a similar thing will happen with Dream League, that eventually Valve will authorize them to run a proper pro circuit with cross all organizers, something yeah, like that. Yeah. Um, uh, so, so Dave says that was awful from me. Yes, Dave, you were yes, absolutely well, yeah, abysmal. Was that was shocking, shocking. Um, so let's imagine a scenario where DPC is gone, TI is gone. The new replacement is it's basically ESL dotes, Dream League, and Riad Masters replaces TI. I personally think, from Valve's perspective, that's the ideal scenario. Because as much as I'm sure a lot of them really enjoy TI, and I'm sure that people really like Valve's hand in TI, if they didn't have to do it, or they could do it, but it's just like a celebration thing, they could even go back to just invites and not have to have the DPC in the qualification. They could just be like, this is just an annual celebration of Dota, and there's no battle pass for it, and the prize pool is not exceptional, it's just a big celebration of Dota. They could do that, rather than have to invest in it and have the battle pass specifically for it. Because I think they would rather spend the whole year working on Dota and making money from it than just have to rely on TI. That's just my guess. Because why else make the change? It's not like TI is less popular. Prize pool's been going up every year. Not last year. Was it lower last year? Yeah. Pretty sure, yeah. Alright, so it was lower because they changed the way the Battle Pass worked. Do you remember? They changed The Battle Pass it. was just wank. No, no, no. Just... They changed it so that the TI was like a third of the way into Battle Pass and then the rest of the Battle Pass was post-TI. Remember that. People forget about that. The Battle Pass persisted for a long time after TI. Yeah. Not at the start. So they made some money at the start. Some of that went to TI. But then most of the Battle Pass time was after. It was oh, later. And they, just, they, they just took more fucking money from it. Yeah, they just made more from it. I mean, they must have done. Because it ran for like two, three months or whatever after TI. I think it was a test run maybe to say, let's see what happens. Will people still play it? I honestly think most people that play Doe don't even watch Pro Doa. I think most people that play Dota play Dota, and it's a game that they play, and occasionally they'll dip into TI. And they don't really. Ashwin, they don't really you've uh, and you've been called up by Johnny Boy, by the way, sitting in unassigned players. He selected you for uh, for the game. Oh, really? Yep. Join him. Hell yeah! <laughs> Are we going to get an Ashy B in the game? <laughs> <laughs> Aries in. Arian on the other side. I, I war. Mm, James. I mean, Ari is technically higher ranked than you, right? That ha that's he that is. should be should be fair. I'm, for I, the I think I'm down to ancient three now. I'm just really yeah, I'm gonna be honest with you, brother. I'd rather have Ashwin over Ari. I was gonna say uh, in a fucking talk about right. expensive. I mean, I think if Ari was in a stack of equally ranked players and he was just playing hard five, I'm sure he'd be fine. Same with Snook. They're support players who've grinded MMR from playing support. But if you get him in a stack where you're like, you're the highest rank, you better go mid because the rest of us are Herald. He fucking sucks. I still, I always, every time I think about Eri, I can laugh about the game I watched of his. He was playing with the lads, he was playing Faces Void. And every single fight, the fight would happen and then you'd hear Eri give an excuse why he didn't kill a single hero in his chrono. Every single fucking fight, the entire game. It was so funny. Still won that game. It. He still did win that game. It was fucking brilliant. Eri says he's been playing three and one in solo queue. I think he is a three player generally. Yeah. I mean that's unbelievable to me. Well, not not. I mean, which three? I guess he's played Spirit Break and Dark too. He's played. Uh, what's where's the Haskell? Is that me? Bob has. A, Bob is actually right. He has called him out correctly here. Eri was bragging about spamming techies for his rank. I'm pretty sure you showed us screenshots, Eri, of you like playing a ton of techies games, saying this is free MMR. Let's go and and investigate. Why Eri lie? Why are you always lying? Who's the fucking lying? Uh, I don't see any techies. Oh, I see two losses on Tetris. Oh, wait, there's one, two, three, four, five, six Techies wins in a row. Sorry, six Techies games, yeah. five five to one in wins, wins to losses. 
Don't see any more though. It was just that. So no, I don't think he's been spamming techies. This is going back to April. So coming up to present day, uh, he is almost <coughs> <coughs> exclusively a three and a one. Earthshaker. Well, that's an L. Spirit Breaker. Uh, that, Earthshaker, that Earthshaker was plus five. The Spirit Breaker was plus five. The Techies was plus five. The Husker was made. The Disruptor was plus five. The Dark Two was plus three. The Techies was plus five. So he is a three and one player, mm. but has played zero games of one and one game of three in the last 10 games. Well, there you go. Eri called out live on stream here at twitch.tv slash Flex. He dreams of being a one player, Astrid. He aspires to be a one player. Or maybe he realizes being playing one is miserable and he's fled to greener pastures. Uh, the Nichols has only played 20 games. No, you are barred from the in-houses. Apologies. Yeah, you got to get to a, to a minimum threshold of dog shit. You can't just be in after, there. After Baron. We, Big we've, Baron. Yeah, we've played some games where both mid versus mid had like 10 games between them, and it was unacceptable. People because just... what, this, what this Baron guy would do is was fucking criminal as well. Because he played for like months, and he still only had 80 games or whatever it was. Like so, but he, all he do is just turn up to the in houses, and then he, he and then he like not play a week, and he come back and we're like, why is he still t so terrible? Well, it's because he plays like one hour a week. Unacceptable. Adam says me and Luke just keep winning MMR, tanking my value. Kick W. There's no way that you and Luke are winning games. Maybe been, maybe Adam maybe Adam you're contributing to some victories, but Luke is a giant drag factor, like one of those parachutes they have behind a drag racing car, he is permanently trying to slow everybody around him down. He has. When he wants see. to win, Luke is actually a really helpful player. The problem is that doesn't happen very often. Yeah, because he just yeah. wants to lose a lot of the time. Fucking baked out of his brain 90% of the time. That's the issue. That has to be the issue. He just has this genetic predisposition to like wanting to waste everyone's time. Nice jump, Alex. Which is like a real bad <laughs> trick like, just if, you, if you had that in CK, you'd like bin that child off immediately. Yeah, well, you know, no sense to do so. <laughs> whatever. Whatever. No, whatever. Fucking pull it together, Luke. Uh, whatever, mate. No. no, mate. No, no, no. Well, the thing is, right? Uh, uh. Radiant team back. Feel free to dono clip. Do it. I want I want more dono clips. The last one we had was a week ago. I realize I've been away for a week, but what's the dono <laughs> clips? They're hilarious. You can record a video and or audio message. It makes me laugh. Grumpy Nerd says, just finished watching game one. How did you guys not notice? Sorry, Grumpy, you'll have to catch me up there, brother. I'll notice what, mate? I don't know if you also noticed, uh, Grumpy, but we weren't watching the game. Yeah, I mean, we, who watches these <laughs> games closely? Maybe you're sad enough to sit and stare at the in-houses hoping to learn something, but the, the rest of us, they're just uh, an exercise in futility. How did you guys not notice? Not notice what? Why Why just be so vague? The enigmatic <laughs> Grumpy Nerd dipping by, coyly suggesting Wild that we didn't notice something. Us not notice something in these in-house games? Why? We are paying our utmost attention. Absolutely. We talked about boxed wine for 30 minutes. What do you we mean? We did. Still, still not. We had a brief stop in a we couple chat. We, we had a notice. brief stop in at a few other chats, I'm sure. Grumpy might Can't be a slow typer. Like, click, click. That might be how he types. You don't know. Maybe his internet's so bad, this is from like. And now he just gives a smiley job, face. Alistair. Whatever, bro. HC FP just resu bed for 20 months. <laughs> I respect it. I respect it. Why don't the lads learn anything? Why the fuck do the lads think they'll learn anything watching it back? Select from users. What What are you, are you trying to say that we're saying the lads don't learn anything, but then they watch it back and they'll learn something? Is that what you're Ten implying? I'll tell you why select from users, you fucking genius. Uh, we've been doing this for about four years now. Remaining. I don't know if you've noticed, but the players have not improved. There's like a handful and a baby's handful of people who have actually gotten better. Most of them try really hard and are fucking dog shit. Stobby, a prime example. Science Wiz Ben has tried really hard, but is still in the in-houses. We've had to bump him down to not playing mid. But if you want to get better, you need to, you know, have some competence level, some base level of competence to build on. 
Hey, hey, good Dyer heavens. Team back. I mean, most of the lads have got jobs, families, etc. They're at university. They're just being chill. They just want to play. Who's Bo Katan strutting? It's a terrible name. Oh, I don't know. I think. Uh, 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 shit, I played with him the other day. I can't remember who it was. Who is the most successful goon to good? Is it Eddie Smalls that's now divine or something? Yeah. He's, he's immortal. Radiant team Eddie Smalls. There you go. It's not savage. <laughs> oh. No, no, he's just saying he's saying he's the code oh, Bo Katan Strutting. What a bizarre name. What's Bo Katan? What it's a very munt like name where you're just like, what are you on about? Bo Katan is a human female princess born on the planet Mandalore into clan cries and overall house cries. Oh, she's one of the Mandalorians. She was the one who was in Battlestar Galactica that was in in Mandalorian. Bizarre. Five seconds remaining. Hugh G by a long shot, says Snutkin. No, it's definitely Eddie Smalls. He was literally an immortal player now. What are you talking about? Hugh has been has been grinding his way up the ranks. He was he started at the very bottom of Herald. Right. Hugh was famously ten MMR and he's right. like Archon now. Hugh, Hugh is in the in houses. You can't call that a graduation if he's still in the in houses. <laughs> I yeah, technically I'm an in house graduate. It's true. But that was when the in houses were dog shit. They were dog shit in a in a different way. Dog shit, but filled with good players. Just the sweatiest tryhards. Guys like Drakesfield and people like that just fucking sweating their bollocks off. This is what I love about these in-house games. I reckon these guys are actually trying their hardest. It just doesn't look like it. it really doesn't. I, I don't think it's possible to say that Dave is trying his hardest when he's playing Dota. I think he's just chilling out after a hard day at the box factory. Relaxing, doing whatever he does, and if he messes up, he goes, Oh, sorry Radiant about that. Team pick. Juggernaut. Radiant team pick. Oh, I do love a jug pick. I am loving the star draft a lot. I actually like both of these drafts, apart from AA. I think AA is a dog shit hero, but. Have, a dying bounty have, feels like a very. I themed their draft quite nicely. I like it so far. Got I feel like a dying bounty is like a very. Ten seconds. It's a very. I don't know, what's the right word? Dynamic, active kind of support duo. They're gonna go around the map and ruin your life. Who's Spirit Breaker uh, AA? No, Undying Bounty. Oh. I think Undying Bounty is way more active than Spirit Breaker AA. I, I would agree if it was something other than Undying. I don't see him as a good ganking hero in all honesty. It's not really about ganking, it's just about when he's in your lane, you can't be in that lane. That's true. And he can just walk around and do that and follow Bounty around if he wants to. Or he can like stick around and stack or pretend, so protect his lads. So one issue, Plague. One issue. You're up against Spirit Breaker, who can charge away. Darkseer, who can surge away. And Storm, who can zip away. Mm -hmm. So... You need some, some major lockdown in these last two picks, I agree. They do. But they've, it's the right picks for major lockdown. It's pause three and pause, pause two. If you're going to get control here, is now's the time. But Bob, Dirtmall is not something we could do every week, brother. Like, I loved Dirtmall, don't get me wrong. No one's saying that Dirtmall wasn't amazing, but we couldn't fucking do it every Tuesday, could we? That was me and Slacks working for weeks ahead of Dirtmall, getting everyone in, making sure everyone was ready, sorting out the schedule, reaching out to small streamers and trying to get them in. Like, it was. it's definitely not something we could do every Tuesday. This is a good filler. Like, I don't think anyone's we arguing that Dirtmall wasn't back. amazing. We should do another one. We should do another one. Are there enough Dota streamers left? <laughs> uh, no. Yeah, me, mate. Me. That's the hard part, is finding Dota communities that we don't know trying to um, get them in, basically. Like, there are plenty of Dota, like very big, very healthy Dota streamers, but they're not also the streamers that would want to take part in Dirt Mall. No, or that we would want. It was always the, it was always like the 100 to 500 viewer range, and they right. don't exist anymore. They've... Not as much. I mean, we could get people like Sheebs and Owen and T and who else streams? Cap. Maybe... I mean, it'd be fun to get someone like Quinn in, Jenkins. It may actually be better to do it off of Discord servers. I feel like there's a lot more people who have, like, 
good Discord servers that might be interested in doing it, like analysts who aren't streamers. Yeah, or like, Hoxie. Ed, like, like that kind of stuff. There could be a way to do it that yeah. way. Get Hoxie. We're not Even get some Bradley. of the pro players We're not gonna have get like Dragon. fairly, fairly access. Yeah, Bradley Discord. Dragon. Then yeah, no. Bradley Dragon would be a legendary. Yeah. No, that's a no. Get Dav in as well. I mean, we we could do it. We could do. We could get another one. I I I'm reluctant to get the South American streamers in simply because there's a time difference. And I don't think they speak English, so probably not. Let's look at Dota right now and see who's streaming that we could grab. I mean, the thing is, Bali Major's on, so Five it's kind of there's a lot of people remaining. missing. We're it's not, not going to get yet, people actually. like so. Oh, they're supposed to be out list there, of people yeah, yeah. we're not going to get, for example, uh, Gorg, Mason, uh, Dendi. Um, we're Did not going to get. Brother. No, no, no. Really? Yeah, I don't, I don't think uh. so. I don't know if he'll he'll really uh, get the vibe of uh, Dirt Maul either. Yeah. Is that Zai? No way. That's not Zai. Oh, I'd, be, I'd be amazed if Zai was streaming. I'd be watching Zai if Zai was streaming. Sorry, I would be out in a fucking heartbeat. I mean, the the, the thing is, I, if I reached out to a lot of people in Dota, we could get them for Dirt Maul. 100%. There's, there's no doubt in my mind. If we timed it for a gap between events, remaining. maybe post-TI or something, we could do another Dirt Maul. We we could do it. We could do it. I mean, I could I could I've worked with or know a ridiculous number of people in Doha, so I could definitely do it. Um, it would be fun. We we could try. We could try. But US East Coast is already five hours, so that's hard enough. I'll reach out to Slack. I love, Slacks the, I love the color combinations on these teams. They yeah. really match their. Yeah, it's good. I mean, they've gone with the the ultimate Ben last pick. Yeah, ben is this is mid Ben? Ben? Big. Oh, absolutely. But we banned him from mid. Well, we supposedly did. Eri, are you actually gonna fucking put your tiny foot down and do something, or are you just gonna let Ben walk all over you? I, you know, I'm, I'm gonna wait for Eri's spawn, but I do believe Johnny's the type of person with the hubris to say no. I can take Ben mid. Do you think? Do you agree? If but if Johnny Boy wants to has said I want to face Ben, then I'm, I'm down to it. It's definitely something. Uh, Wait, Johnny so Eri now to... says this is news to me. <sighs> to be fair, probably when we said it, it was like two a.m. for Eri. So <sighs> this is why the in houses suck. Why is there one game every evening where the period after the draft ends and the game yeah, starts is like a minute longer than it should be? I think I think it's because the game only starts when everyone has selected their heroes after. Right. The finish. Yeah. So there's just gonna be some guy who just someone like, has. I'm going to wait. Right. Right, who am I following this late stage? I mean, obviously Bonnie Joy v Ben is gonna be banned. That's all I'm watching. Prepare for uh, battle. I do. Stannis says Yogg's fans are cringe. Yes, true. Um, absolutely it's not, true. It's not, it's not false. I mean, I'm sure you've called them cringe pretty much permanently. Too. I, I, they don't like me, and so it, it's, you know, it is what it is. And what it is, is they're cringe. They're, I mean, oh, hi, hi, remaining Harry Raiders, by the way. Thanks oh, for sticking around. Up? Well, Harry doesn't count. <laughs> Harry's Harry, man. Harry viewers know what's up. <laughs> Also, none of them stuck around. Web and on no, again, it's they, character they were, they were, they were straight, 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 straight out. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Web and on again, it's character fight. saying, "Good luck, have fun." Oh my God, Bonnie Joy's got the W level one, and he's used it on the spinning jug. That is fucking hilarious. Yes, Bonnie Joy. Was he, is he question marking his own play? Because I can respect that. Yeah, I, I hope so. <laughs> Look at uh, this. This is gonna be another game where MPI is just gonna tear lads to pieces. He is he is genuinely the ace of these in houses. Who he is? always plays off lane, he has a great lane, NPR. Oh yeah, he's he's legit. He always has a fucking fantastic old time in the off lane and carries. He always too. plays the meta off laners as well. He 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 studies the, the meta and perfects it. 
Well, let's see if uh, let's see if he can persuade his bounty hunter to stack for him, though. This is this is <laughs> He is two this for is two. Funny. He's two for yeah, two. Yeah, he's two. he's doing he's doing great. I mean he has he walked it, it's not like he leveled up the electric vortex in the fight. He walked up there with vortex skin. <laughs> so he was always planning to be a vortex hey, sorry, level one gamer. Do you have any idea what you're talking about? This is the meta mate. Yeah. This is the meta smells doing vortex level one. This is, <laughs> this is what yeah, dear, Thompson, Thompson's a big fan of this build. <laughs> I mean, he has got his bottle done, pretty much. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> he has not got his bottle done, gotta get one more CS. There we go. Bottle done. Bob, shut the fuck up. Denied. I don't know who wins Storm versus Primal. I've never seen it. Uh, I believe Primal. Storm oh, really has... should 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 do great. To be honest. Really? The, the, like, I don't think yeah, so. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Remnant is, Remnant is, 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 is like you do a lot of damage on Storm. That's that's can't be denied. And if you have some some guy walking up to you, like getting ready to be hit by, like three remnants and three over overloads. Like, I just think overload. Ben wins every single one of these trades. He does. But I mean, I'm just talking m more about the matchup. Yeah, I but think that, in is, the that is the matchup. I think I equal think skilled players, Primal should win. I think so. Primal is off to pick mid, yeah. I, I Storm is Storm is a really good laner. I think it's so. under think underestimate so? how good. How, yeah, yeah. He's like a piss load of nuke for not. I mean, the one thing he has over Ben, and it's an important thing, is he has she has like reliable lane push. Like he can just spam out the lane quite quickly. But he has no kill threat on Primal, and Primal can just if he got, does it right, just kill him quite easily, right? I I don't think that's correct. No. Oh, fair. But I have been wrong before. Is Falcon Blade the build on Storm now? I don't know. It's it's meant to be alright. I think it's okay. It's it's, it's better than it is on most heroes. Like yeah, because Storm Storm loves the early game stats and loves the early game mana region, so it's like fine. I mean, with Storm, basically you are mana. Like your mana yeah. is more important than anything else. I think you're you're supposed to go something like Falcon Blade. Treads and Witch Blades. And if you get those three items quite fast, you're in for a fine game. And you can just you can just go around the map and brutalize anyone you come across. He rotates really well. Yeah. It's just a big fucking brick wall. Look at that, he's got thousand HP and eight armor. He is currently absolutely dumpstering Ben as well. Out CSing him cleanly. You're talking about Storm. Yeah, Bonnie Joy. So I was just talking about how Primal Beast is a big brick fucking wall. He is a big brick fucking wall, but he's a big brick fucking wall that's missing out on CS. Yeah, well, Johnny Boy's a little better than Ben, I think, when he's on his game. Because Johnny's a cocky bastard. You do need to have a bit of a bit of a bit of arrogance be a bit cocky, in player. Yeah. yeah. I mean, if your name is Science Whiz Ben, I'm just saying that doesn't fill me with confidence. Johnny Boy sounds like a lad who's an absolute Johnny Boy shagger. is, yeah. <laughs> to me. Ooh, very nice. That's a cute little play. Gets a tank two tower hits. I uh, I, I saw a really funny meme the other day. It was uh, a Twitter account. It was saying, blokes would be like, oi, oi, here comes the legend. And their, their mate Josh walks in. <laughs> and it's just some bloke. It's like just their <laughs> super average mate. I, I, I thought it was funny because his name was Josh, and obviously yeah, we know a lot of Joshes. 
But just it is absolutely true. They're like, whoa, here he is. And he's just like the most average <laughs> the most, guy. But like normal human yeah, being. Just a regular guy. Was it Greg? Such... I think it is Greg. Oi, oi. And it's just their mate Greg. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, no, that is how we treat Greg, actually, yeah. So, so far, it's been pretty even in, in the bot lane. NPR has not pulled out the lead yet, but he's got Vanguard now. It's going to be increasingly hard for Mueta. He hasn't Mueta. died. Job done. It's going to get harder for the Mueta to, Mueta to bully him. What is his dog? His dog is like a lizard skin covered boar. I don't know how to do the zoom in view anymore. They got rid of it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but the observers were using it. They maybe have some, like, shortcut or, or key or something like that, but we can't do it anymore. Or maybe we can, Even but we can't do it in-game. I mean, if you can see a way to do it, then uh, I, I'll, I'll be happy, but I can't see a way to do it. I bet it's some, like, command key, some garbage like that, you know? Maybe. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. I I is buyback status for me, boy. I is indeed buyback status. Inserts. Yeah, the showcase view. Dyer's middle tower is under attack. Ooh, pardon me. It was there unbound, really? Under spectator? I'm not seeing it, team. Advanced hotkeys. Showcase view. Where is it? It's um, a spectator. There we go. No, it's just on camera actions. Advanced hotkeys. Dyer's top tower is under attack. Yay! There we go. Oh, the tombstone's gone down, and they got a kill. Hey, I've got mine as well. Fantastic. There we go. That's the kind of treat you can have. It's a close-up of a tower. Dyer's top tower has fallen. Gandalf the Grump. Who's that again? Oh, I haven't a clue. Who's Mitch, I don't recognise the profile picture either. Who's Gandalf the Grump? I think this might be a new new player to the in-house because they're not part of the 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 guild, right? Grumpy nerd, maybe. No, because he, he was in chat. He played game one. Who did he play? Axe. I don't remember. So when he said, "Did they not notice?" Was it because he was in the game, and that's what he was talking about? Did you last uh, not notice? Yeah, I, it was I something think I he saw in game. Because it yeah. was game one. No, I think well, we said something. He asked something about game one, and I was like, we talked about it. And then he was like, did you not notice? Or something. He was also. He said later on that he's basically in a in a caravan at the moment with terrible Wi-Fi and typing on his phone, which is why he didn't respond. <laughs> uh, be honest, my face, because he kept lagging out and couldn't type anymore. So <laughs> that's why it's been a bit disconnected. Gotcha. Well, that's a kill if they get the roar now. Oh, beast was so strong. We got the charge coming. Muet is gonna throw out some damage as well. Mu uh, Misses a Q and he gets away. Cool, what he's in. Oh, Ben's here as well, but he didn't stop trapping. He got silence as he went through, right? Now Storm is here. This could be. Oh, he's got the children. He's got children. You actually have to be dead without the children. Oh, good charge. He has a lovely charge. Oh, the bash. Go on, fuck him up. Oh man, he actually would have died with that children. Good save. Fucking shield rune, bro. Yep, yet get another out. rune that can fuck off. We DD got, uh... rune is not as bad now because it doesn't go straight into Rove, so I'm okay yes. with it. We got traumatized by a spirit breaker last night. It still proved the hero is is as strong as ever. Yeah. Wh sorry, which hero? Spirit breaker. Mm. 
we were <laughs> crushing a game, we and also, this we kind of like fucked up, pretty pretty big time. Where did we fuck up? I mean, we we were very very outranked. Uh, so it was a, it was an yeah. uphill battle most of the game. I mean, I, 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 mean, I just remember the final fuck of the end where I was getting gone on and you was just like not swapping me busy. I think you were trying to wait until I was really. Oh ready. yeah 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 yeah. Because I think I still think we were, we could have won the game if I was alive. And then after I died, it was a I good fucking nothing. game though. It wasn't a game that I was like I ended and was salty about. I was fuck it. It was just a good fucking game. Ben just killed Muerta. Oh, I was I was I was furious. Mate. I was Wait. furious. Where banana says two sex ping. Can't be losing to Ruby though. That's just something tipped. Ping. I don't particularly think. I don't know actually. I don't know. I think Mud's items build. My build was a bit weird. I mean, it's the dude. It's the all hero challenge, you know. It's yeah. It's we can't do anything about. I feel like it. Sometimes, you could have benefited from like a, a Yules or like a Blink or something. Sometimes um, your your friend just, just had... wants to play Zeus. Yeah, and, and he happens. went for the Ags, which is just not that matter, is it? He didn't go up to green either. No, weird one. Still, it was a good, a good, a GG, as they say. We really could have benefited from a Yules on anyone, to be honest. And they, they were just not forthcoming. Not an yeah. item people really get these days. I think Mikey was working towards on the end. because I didn't build pipes. I was going for my stupid ass build. Oh yeah, we do went for the Octarine build, didn't you? I did. And then I, I thought you were going to go Bloodstone. Pipe. I was surprised you went Octarine and not the Bloodstone there. Bloodstone. You got Bloodstone in the end, but I thought you were going to go yeah. Bloodstone before Octarine. Well, I, 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 I don't know. I, I, I know those items are what I meant to build. I just didn't know what order. Yeah. So, Julian Sands. You know Julian Sands, the actor? Probably before yeah. you know time. I've, I've, he went missing in, in January. Um, and they found him in Mount Baldy. Uh, Mount Baldy. Which I remember because when we were in California, we drove past it and the kids were very excited. Maybe they were like, Daddy, is that where you were born? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I like that the goons and your children have the exact same brand. Oh, yeah. yeah. Although my youngest, she's very sweet. She said to me, I like you being bold. It wouldn't be the same if you weren't. And I was like, that's because all, all, all you've ever known is me being bold, sweetheart. But she was like, no, you'd look weird with hair. I was like, again? You've never seen me with hair. Because we were driving past on the bus. We were going past somewhere I used to live. And I said to her, I used to live there. I said, that was so long ago. That was before you were born. And that was when I still had hair. And she immediately said something positive. She's a very sweet girl. She's like, you look better without hair. Don't worry about it. And then the eldest is like, yeah. Why you fucking you bald cunt? Fuck you bald cunt. Why you fucking wake up? Why? <laughs> so I couldn't see the apartment because of the shine off your massive dome. Why? <laughs> Uh, good night. Exactly. Go get a pint of please. A pint of Muerta, Baldy boy. <laughs> As expected, NPR top of the net worth. Beastmaster just farming up a storm. Just a farmy lad. Are there any stacks? One <clears> stack? <throat> just the one stack. They don't do stacks in game games. It's no, stack, really stacking's happened. hard. Stacking's fucking hard. Ooh, nice. A nice kill. A poor AA ult, Very poor. It was a bit, bit late to the party, but... Now Muet is once again being chased. I mean, she should always survive Primal. Okay. You can just deadshot him as he's charging in, right? And he'll stop it. Am I crazy? What? Or does it go through that? Does, uh, does Onslaught like keep going through fear? Oh. What's Onslaught? I don't play the Primal Q. No, I doubt it. No, I know, it's like, definitely interruptible. There's a charge. It's not. He's not gonna get away. I don't think. He's still got. Oh my god, he is! What? Oh Why shit! They, they really fucked up there. Yep, they're terrible. I, I've actually not seen Webin on the land a dead shot yet. By the way, he just misses them. Off cooldown almost, it's impressive. I wonder Still, if he's he gonna is. go slom. What on the I think it is the it is the build, right? On on beast. 
I mean, all the bros get slom. Yeah, it is the it is the standard. If Ace gets slom, get slom. Nice jump, Alistair. KFM di just resu bed for 28 months. Clap. Clap. Grazie. Will Web Brain Cell do anything with this Muerta? Owen also says Muerta. Does he actually? Yeah, if you listen to him in a car, he says Muerta with an alt here! Like, he says, <laughs> Owen is like a massive slaphead when it comes to. He's, he's got that voice. He's just British. Don't know what they're doing here. Fucking Muerta. We were laughing about it. I can't remember when we watched one of his cars. He said Muerta. <laughs> Muerta. What is this? Random tombstone. What? That's a chrono play. I love it. Yeah. Where is it? It's just he just dumped it's it down in mid. There's no heroes here. <laughs> He's just placed it where, down. Where is it? I can't even see it. Uh, right in front of mid tier one dire. On the high ground. It's hidden behind the oh Oregon purse line. What the fuck? What a gaboon. The lads. Why is every fucking one of Radiant's here is here? What's going on? They're just... It's the, I suppose it's the, the bonding joy effect, you know? Very charismatic leader, just gathers people around them. Mad Larkin, what's not Spanish? Muerta? I think it is. Muerta! Oh, they've got oh, Chrono, the somehow. On in for some reason. I mean, it might be a oh, good Oh, this thing. is not good. Can we get the suck like we can? This could be bad for Ben. That's good a, a raw. It's an okay roar, I don't think it's going to help. Oh, finally, a good dead shot! There's a charge through, that's a lovely charge. Oh, it's a good charge. Gandalf the Grump with the top. Gandalf is appearing to be quite good. Why would you, that's not Spanish ellipsis, about the word Muerta, when it is? What are you talking mu about? Mu if you're saying the pronunciation is bad, that's a different Dyer's sentence, isn't it? <laughs> it's Mexican, isn't it? You'd say, that's not how yeah. you say it. But you're saying, that's not Spanish, ellipsis. Oh, uh, uh, that's not Spanish. The confident internet dot 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 never gets old. GG, ellipsis. Oh, they found Chuck. But can they do anything with it? What's going uh, on? Does Jug not spin? He could just he spin and walk away. Oh! oh that Good on the should get a kill? I think he okay. might have just killed himself. He has a bit. <laughs> not respecting the, the AA ulti, really. Thought the yeah. healing ward would keep him going. Yep. They actually yep. could be... I don't know about this Beastmaster build, to be honest. What, the I, Crimson I've Guard? I've seen no. the, the, the Helm of Overlord rush, I've seen the Ags rush. I've not. I thought he was going Helm of Overlord with his starting items. But Crimson Guard is, has just killed his own momentum, like, incredibly hard. Who won mid? I think Bonnie Joy probably shaved. Bonnie Joy stomped mid pretty uh, hard. I didn't say stomped, because he. I don't think he killed Ben. No, but, but. He certainly did get everything he wanted out of it, but, um. He, he did if win it, it but uh, he, he, I, I will say this, Primal Beast is not out of the game, it's just that um, he's not having yeah. the best one. Storm is certainly doing stormy things. If if your mid Primal is the same net worth as the enemy's pos 4 That's uh, 17 minutes, there is there's something has to have gone wrong with the lane a but bit. That, that yeah. might I think, also I think none, be... of, none of his ganks have landed. I yeah. don't Ben's know about these fun. drums, to be honest. Yeah. These drums feel a little bit strange. I, I think mean, I, need a bit more tanky. I don't understand why Blame My Heart is the build. But it is apparently the yeah, thing Yeah, this to do. is not the build. Yeah, the drums seem real strange, especially as you've already got a phase boot, so you can't get the drums. He of, killed Ben over the top the power drums. rune? I might have missed that. Or we just don't care. One of the two. Gotta respect the storm match. Stupendous. Got banned cause too good. No, you got banned because you were being a cunt. Let's just get that on the record. Who, who said that? Johnny Boy in his uh, Bonnie Joy dot got banned cause too good. <laughs> you well, were actually did it. You were actually being did a twat. Back. Just fucking shit talking in game. It's just. Too oh much. yeah. Oh, now he's in and he's going for Chrono. Chrono's just fucked. He is out of mana though. 
Yeah, you can't that is some it. kind of charge. They backed up. Yeah. Bye bye, free. So he's gone for the. Question mark? <laughs> it was this kind so this... of shit, I believe. What the Herald was that? <laughs> what uh, the this... Herald was that? This is not the standard storm build, but it is a fun one to do because no one expects the orchid anymore. Yeah, it's not which is dying. weird. But if you can get it to work. Oh my god, oh, this is a lovely air. That's huge. Oh, it's big. What a jabonga. You're going to get Ben as well, probably. Doctor's not even dying, he's fine. Wow. Wow. This is looking real bad. NPR is going to die as well, probably. There's the charge. Jug is the only one actually getting stuff on the map, and he's top net worth to be fair, so if they if they can convert something off this Jug's farm, then they do still have chances. At the moment they're just like are just running face first into a very strong Storm Spirit and Spirit Breaker. Yep. They immediately lose one, they're stunned everywhere. Oh, I was looking up the showcase settings? Yeah, I missed it, apologies. <laughs> It was important though, it's It it's, was it's... vital, because now I can do this. Look at that little lad run. Dyer's Hell yeah. Is under attack. Look at Darks here. Look at Darks here in showcase mode in his little coat. Let me have a look. How do you look at showcase mode? M. I, I, I bound it to M. We've had this conversation. I thought I had it bound it was, to I. It is bound to I, but it won't work because I is also one of your. Uh, like... um... Uh, info settings. Where's the hotkey for it then? The the it's bounty the bounty has been terrible. Case. The lads don't know how to use them properly. Um, uh, I, I think we 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 actually saw this on the pro scene. People were picking bounty, and trying to do things with him. Saxa is one of the best players I've seen to abuse this um, possible bounty. It, I can't remember which patch it was on. It was on the new patch. It was on like the frontiers or whatever. But. He essentially just s snowballed from the lane. You can't just dilly dally in the lane. You've got to snowball the lane. And the way he does it is by continually harassing and killing the enemy, uh, like fives and stuff. Um, and he, he just did that and then following the carry around and making their life a misery. Like, I, I haven't seen Shaq do anything. He's just been walking about. Um, <clears throat> he's like, it's tracking another tube stone down. Why is there another tube scene down? Because well, he's not very good, Plague. It's Chrono. But there's, there's no Radiant Heroes there. Well, well, I've made this fairly clear. The Chrono is the worst of the goons. There's the Omni. He could get some oh, couple kills here. If he gets banned off the grub, that's a good oh, that's kill. That's, that's a lot of money for him. He's about to get a second! Oh, oh my god! Oh shit! Oh, oh shit. shit! Oh Jesus! That's so much money for Ben. Good for ben him. just got like 2k almost. Radiant's middle tower Rip the flawless tower. game. If there is any pause one that can scumbag their way to a victory in <laughs> these conditions, it is Chuck. He's suddenly off the off the back of that Gandalf kill, top net worth. Oh, he's top net worth. Well, he's higher higher up there at least. It was a lot of money. Yeah. More, more top. You're right. He got was... almost he got an eight three five gold from a support spirit breaker. So That's as, as someone who pointed out, by the way, the only reason I wanted to turn showcase mode on was to look at the boars that Beastmaster has, which are these lizard creatures, and yeah, I hadn't done it until just now, and someone reminded me. That's what I wanted it for. And they are pretty cool looking. They are pretty dope. Wahoo! I like the way they run around. Like they're, they're great. They're, you know. Nice jump, Alistair. Glitch trattino basso 42 just resubbed for 23 months. 23 months, grazie, glitch 42. You could have got Molto one of these bene. instead of a fucking uh, Frenchie Ted, mate. What? Could have got a lizard. Got a lizard dog thing. Instead of a Frenchie? Poison. Yeah. What does that and mean? Ball. What? What's a a French instead of Aggie. Oh, I see what you're saying. When you said a Frenchie, I thought you meant a French person. <laughs> I, was like, well, I don't, I don't own one of them. Well, you got Mun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not English, <laughs> says the bloke from fucking Hastings that sounds incredibly English. <laughs> yeah, true. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. Oui, ça c'est true. C'est vrai. Oui, c'est vrai. 
vrai ou euh, est, euh, oui c'est vrai c'est vrai c'est <laughs> c'est très vrai oui how do you say that's just how it is man yeah any frenchies in chat how do you say that's just the way it is dude yo yeah, google google translate dyer's bottom tower is under attack english to french Oh my god, he's gonna get stunned by the ogre! Oh, get to me. Oh. Uh, I think I'm... Oui, c'est vrai. Oui, c'est vrai, c'est vrai. Oui, c'est vrai. C'est comme ça, mec. That's how you say it. C'est comme ça, mec. How would you say that's pretty true? Uh, oui, c'est vrai. C'est vrai. C'est vrai. C'est assez vrai. C'est vrai. C'est assez vrai. C'est comme ça, mec. <laughs> Oh, they can go for Stormy. He's got no mana. They've roared him. They've omnied him. He's down. Look, chat. Both popping in with Cella V. You were wrong. That means that such is life. Cella V means such is life. We Don't want a direct translation shit. of... Uh, That's how it is. It That's just how it is, dude. And the translation is... C'est comme ça, mec. Mec. Is mec just like man? Chat. Don't know. Don't know, mate. This is quite the comeback. They are really turning this game around. They really are. I don't know I, what is going on. I think it was that, that big pickup. Banana is real useless. I think there's, it was that, that big pickup from Ben. There's, there's two big problems for Radiant, right? Worst is all of their kills went to Spirit Breaker. That guy was actually the main like net worth differential with Spirit Breaker compared to the other sports. And it's just a support Spirit Breaker. It's not the fucking end of the world if he's farmed. Uh, and B. Orchid. Orchid builds. It works until it doesn't. And when it stops working, it stops working really bad. And now Bonnie Joy is kind of useless. Compared to if he had a lot more damage from Witchblade and like part of an axe or whatever. Look, for people correcting it in chat, if you want, get in touch with Google Translate and tell them that they're wrong. But I'm not going to believe Twitch. Also, also the, the, when he says that's just how it is, dude, that that's not him saying like, like that that's life or something. That He's saying... He's effectively just saying that's true again. He's not. He's not saying, "Oh, that that's just." He's not saying, no, "Ah, oh, such life. is life." Yeah, or, he's just saying, "What will be, it. will be." Literally he's literally how it is. saying, true and, "Exactly." Yeah, that's pretty true. That's true. And, yeah, that's true. That's true. what is going on here. This is another fucking. Wait, uh, yeah, subway, subway. Oh, it's a nice wall, but. But they have, no, get, they have no damage. Muerte is already dead. Where's the damage? Where's the damage? We're gonna get Chrono. Can Bonnie Joy get out of this one now? They have only slashed back up. Charge. If they get the job. You have to. Oh, there we go. Oh, he summoned Illusion. Oh my God, Beastmaster trolled him. Beastmaster walked back through the wall, summoned down. an Illusion, and it meant Omni Slash didn't kill Darkseid. That's hilarious. That's rough. Hello. If you're not French, fuck off. Fuck off. Le if you are French, le also. Le is what it is. Fuck exactly. Le is what it is. Le is what it is. We separate. Separate. Le is what it is, dude. We. Le, that's true. Yeah, le that's pretty true. Le true. Le true. Le, and yeah, true. le pretty true. Le true. <laughs> <laughs> le, that's just how it is. Bro. We have actually, I have just seen this, there has been another thing added to the soundboard. Suck my it? nuts, uh, Reddit, all on follow me, you're all cringe. <laughs> <laughs> the way it peaks uh, madly when he's talking as well. I love the way Quinn's thing is going. <laughs> he is uh, one of my favorite Dota players for sure. Dudes, dudes a laugh right to hang out with Jenny. Right of it. Just the right nicest A real, a real uh, good lad. Not in his pubs, but that's what <laughs> makes it funny. Like I said, Dota changes people, man. Quinn's a super chill, nice dude, and then you get him in a game of Dota. You guys are literal fucking animals. You are subhuman. <laughs> I need you, I need you to get a Discord call with me and prove to me that you're human, alright? <laughs> you prove to me that you're human, I won't ban you. <laughs> That's just so funny.
Well, this is quite the turnaround. I mean, Mueta yep. is, is determined to do as little damage as uh, possible. Build, build, done nothing build, build the BQB. Give in, like, drop your pride, build BKB, and maybe kill someone in the I fight. think that where Brain Cell is the wrong lad to hang your game on. Uh, yeah. Do you know what? If, if Johnny loses this, my plan is to string a, a huge line of question marks at him. Um, yeah. But it will not shatter his confidence one bit. And no, honestly, of I, I, although I think he's despicable, that is hugely respectable. The, he will. It will only make him want to come back. The it, thing is, yes, it empowers. He will come, want to come back next week and do the same to his opponents. So what we're doing is storing up trouble for the future. This oh. might not be the fight, boys. Oh hello, who's this jump on? That's Bounty dead. Who cares? Big oh wall. God, this oh is my a this god! Is, this is a fight. What's going on? That's lovely from Ben, though. So that's the first time Wes has been able to actually fight, I'd say, and not just been blown up at the start. And look how fucking well it went. Yep. I'd, I'd like to see the damage stats. Trouble for Ben. He has charge in one. He's... Oh, he didn't go over the cliff. He fucked it. But they haven't noticed. He fucked it. He's away. He's actually very speedy with the phase and boots of bearing. I don't know. Oh, he's got two boots. He is a double booter. This is the old build. This is the old build before the, the blade mail build. Uh, show fight recap. Look how much damage Moeta can do if she's not controlled. And she like is able to click away. It's Ooh. insane how much more damage she did yeah. compared to everyone else on the team. So, uh, as Pantyhose says, the prove that you're human is the all-time best trash talk I've ever seen in Dota. I, I think it actually is. Prove yeah. to me that you are a human being. <laughs> <laughs> it's because it's both. It's because he has said it in game as well, but the, he always says it to his chat. It's like I want you to prove to me that you're human, and I'll, <laughs> I'll let you keep chatting. <laughs> it's so funny. Fantasy points, alright, who do you guys think is top? Oh, I am gonna say... It ain't Bounty, uh, and it ain't Undying, I'm gonna say that. I, I, have, I, I haven't clicked it It's gotta be Spirit Breaker. It's well, I, I think Breaker, it's yeah. either Spirit Breaker or, oddly enough, it might be AA. Because this game is weird like that. It is Spirit Breaker, then Jug, then Storm. AA is third from bottom. Hasn't been warding. And going Ooh. after AA Speak here, off. there's a Raw on Muerta. They have and where to get her off? She absolutely can, and she will. Big bang! Oh, there comes oh, damage! Fucking... Oh, that's a nice, oh, crap, that's a though. nice grab. Oh, the bat! That's enough. She's still okay. Lagging quite a bit for me. Yep, yeah. Yes, the dark here. illusions. They actually get won ben. the fight. They get Ben. They have won the fight. Wait. There's the le chargeon. Oui, avec le bash, le bash. Le dix-sept avec le dix-sept percent. I I um I didn't see this jugs build. I don't know what the fuck this swift link is supposed to be. I think this is desperately incorrect. It's old school, mate. The lads don't know. Uh, you are just supposed to get butterfly, and you are you are you are free reign in these fights. So the sure. the swift blink into Omni Slash used to be a thing that people did, right? Yeah, it did. But it's just less reliable than having the attack speed anyway. So when it says plus fifty percent blade dance lifesteal, yes, does that mean he already has lifesteal on? on, on no. Uh, so it's saying you will now have fifty percent. Correct. Yes. So interestingly, that is the reason that people were saying this hero is viable is purely because yeah. of that. Oh, Gandalf! Gandalf the Grump, please get some of these, brother. Oh. I was I was a big fan of the of the lifesteal before before it was actually oh good. Oh my god, it was cool. dude! Very very. Before ahead it was cool. He got was one. Cool. So that was a double <laughs> wave. He got one. One. It happens. It happens to the best of us. But yeah, it just means it means this jug. Instead of being like a, oh, I hope this Omni Slash lands, and if it does, we win the fight. If it doesn't, it's over. Right. Now, he's actually can stand toe to toe and brawl. And it's, it's, should things be getting tough, he can Swift Slash and Satanic up a bit. Right, right. Or Omni Slash and go to full health. It gives it's, him so many more options. It's sort of like uh, fucking uh, Sunder. Yes, that's exact. That is the perfect metaphor. It's like having your, your Sunder. So you, you'll feel confident fighting someone uh, to the brink of death. Which Jug has never had previously, really. Indeed. He's always been like, I have to get out past, like, it spins down, right, I kind of have to think about leaving, I've got to poke around the edges. Now he can just be in there.
Tournée de 29 et Dismont and 29 et Mont Sud. Oh, ils vont faire du gameplay. Happy 29 et uh, birthday, Twaffle. Grazie pour le sub. Grazie. 29. I was going to switch the TTS to French. How do we feel about that? I'm, I'm big on French. I want to learn my French numbers a little better. <coughs> like, like which one? Just all of them, mate. Just all of them. I think it's pretty standard until like 80, 80 and then it's 80 because they're like 420 420s and the 7 yeah but in French it is uh, simple 80 is fucking... uh, like 420s but why isn't got... 60 th 230s oh, that's just ridiculous well yeah, that would be stupid wouldn't it that would be stupid <laughs> it's because they don't they count they, they should name 0 0 van <laughs> <laughs> Quatre zero vingt zero. I want to hear a really strong French accent. Uh, Bonne joie, just served for. It has, it, has to have the it has to have the smoker's voice. Yeah, it has, it has to. to. And it has to say. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, oh, before it starts talking. <laughs> oh, Bonne joie, just served for. Quarante centimes. <laughs> They're gonna find Bonnie Joy, speak of the devil. <laughs> oh, they've ruined the NPR! You that is a great charge, dude. holy shit. Bruno is dead. He is. There's not more available. Where is Team? Warren. And on there's the, the rule, there's there the only slash is down. Could have done the start of the fight, but at least it happened now. It's a big oh, it's ball. a nice play. But it's Can late. Can Gandalf the Grump get back in here? He's got charge. Mouet is there's coming back charge. in. Nice. Oh, careful that NPR. Oh, he's still been caught. Bash. 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 Pad the bash. Being punted. There it is. Now bash. There it is. There we go. Ah, oh, Jug just, does not just... have Ags, by the way. I know his his build is it was it's so wrong. This it's is going this the is wrong almost. I, I feel like a lot of the lads they they think this is like my ult is a good spell. I will build entirely around that. Yeah. It's like he's all about blinking in and ulting. That's that's the whole plan here. Is I'll blink in and with the swift slash I'll go like. Cha -cha 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 -cha. But if you had more useful items, you might be winning these fights. Now you're losing two lanes. Dyer's bottom tower has fallen. What if you get specialist array on Muet? Because she already has uh, the twin shot shit. Another three shots. I don't even know if it adds that much. To be honest, though, the stats are always fantastic. Uh, well, there we go. There's both. No, uh, one, one and a half. They should be able to hold this. Well, the swift, the swift thing is done. So if it's going to have impact, it's got to be the next fight. I'm going to, I'm going to change it right now. Uh, the, the, it just the ring road fucking comment. What does he say? Come on, Aaron. Oof, a la tele. <laughs> 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 oh dear. Alright, uh, streaming tools. Uh, overlays. Royal blue alerts. This is very complicated, by the way. Settings. Subscriber alert. Uh, TTS settings. Select TTS voice. Hands. Nice. We haven't used hands nice in some time. Nice job, Alistair. Vandred 921, just for better, just for better. Welcome back, welcome flaps. back, Flaps. Let's hold, go, hold, let's go, yeah. count up, count up. Hold off on the subs a little bit, please, because... Oh, uh, French, let's try... Selin. Oh, no, we want Mathieu. Mathieu. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see Mathieu. Uh, variation settings. I did ho 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 mode. Yeah. So that this is, we've currently been using Alessandro, so let's remember that. Let's 
Search for language. Mathieu. Alright, there, we've made it French. Next time someone subs, it should be in French. Someone sub. Oh, shit. I was going to say, I got you, but Vandras has done it. Thank you, but gift subs won't work. Yeah, it won't work. <laughs> it won't do these to the voice message. A real sub. But thank you very much. Sadly, uh, because people would sometimes give 20 or more at a time, I had to turn it off to just say nice so and so job, gifted Alistair. subs. <laughs> <laughs> it's really weird. It sounds way more robotic than the Italian that voice. That's much worse than Alejandro. <laughs> Whatever the fuck it was. This lad. Char tu qu'un just aux ubay de fort vingt mons, soixante dix sept mille sept cent soixante dix sept. Nice job, Alistair. Et où qui just aux ubay de fort dix sept mons, wiza tis a true. Nice job, Alistair. Minor tire basé dix just aux ubay de fort vingt cinq mons, quatre vingt quatre quatre vingt 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 quatre En plus de 105 just aux Zubé de Fort 77 Mons. Oh, 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 Bonnie Joy has done it. I believe on schedule, almost 11 p.m., we can clock out. Mwah, c'est parfait. I, I, I do love what he says. Arissa Bed. Arissa Bed for 40 years of the moons. They go back in again. Oh, the trouble for NPR. The trouble for, for Gandalf, actually. Oh, oh my god, man. that yeah, Octarine no. shit. That was insane. Lads, your cores are dead for a hundred seconds. Surely with the question mark in the game for 26 months. Good try, X. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> what a prick. What a f. And they, their team name is Don't Cry When You Lose. He is a bell end. Through through. No wonder Greg is the way he is. <laughs> well, gents, that's that. Once, as always, GG's. That was a fun week. Thanks for hanging out and occasionally talking about dotes. I appreciate it. Mm. It's very fun. <sighs> I will see you boys tomorrow. Cheers for watching, everybody peace else. Up. Thanks to the boys for casting. Take it easy, lads. Peace, peace, peace. Bye. Right, I'll see you lot tomorrow as well. Cheers for watching. Take it easy. Bleh.